Hello. Hello. Are we actually live? Yeah, bro. Are you sure? Uh, it says stream live. It says so. What's you got over what there? Have you done? Are we so live? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? Just, are in, we? Are we? Are we? Sure? Just in case we are. Blooper real. We are indeed. Yeah, we are. <laughs> My name's Sai. This is JK. This is Ash. And uh, this is uh, one hell of an introduction. Yeah. Welcome to Against the Fence, From the song. and of course, this is your WrestleMania watch along. <laughs> no, I'm joking. It is uh, UFC Vegas '90, Allen versus Curtis Two, um, a battle of <laughs> battle, battle, middleweights <laughs> for the second time. Can he do it yeah, again? Indeed, so. Can he do it again? Yes. Can Chris Can Curtis sneak on in at uh, a, an, an advantageous point in his career? to get the win against um, Brendan Allen. And can he do it for the second Allen's time? On a tear at the moment, he is he? an incredible tear. I mean, the first time they matched up, again, it was, well. though, it was he was supposed to fight Delite last time, Allen, and then that was when Chris stepped in to take that fight. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah man, this guy's full of surprises. And could he do it again is the big question on everyone's lips tonight. If you yeah, guys are tuning in exactly the yeah. next day, don't forget we have chapters below. This whole thing is about not watching alone, but yes, watching along. <laughs> So use that to resync the experience. Right now, we're just at the highlight of the comet of the prelim. Sorry, um, headline of prelim is McGee versus Moreno. Uh, just enough yeah, final round to running it back a bit. I mean, if you see me blank out from it, I'm just watching. Yeah, oh, intensely spinning kick to the body. Ooh, there. Another spinning yeah, punch too. I think. Not... Um, yeah, I don't know why they're like behind on the schedule. Yeah, a bit behind. I mean, they had really some good. knockouts, which surprised them. Oh, do you know what it was? They played that little promo of Chris and his girlfriend, didn't they? Oh, that was at the start of the night, but I think <laughs> yeah. that was, yeah, that was I see fine, that. <laughs> really, to make up time. I don't know. Mm. I don't know. I reckon, Anyhow, I reckon uh, Psycho like, Paul's well, in the house. There. He says, evening, fellas. Oh, uh, 300 a week section. away. Who's excited? Yes, Psycho Paul. We've got some big stuff coming from what, uh, exactly? the way. Huh? One week away from what? Oh, shut up. Uh, Breezy's in the house. Who says <laughs> yes? We are. Oh, What's up, Breezy? And uh, Blake G is one of the biggest fans. Welcome in. On the channel. Welcome in. Yes. Welcome, Welcome in. on in, Blake G. Um, Seriously, you do that one more time, I'm going to go mad. Who are you on about? Who? Um, Morono. Do it for Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Sorry. <laughs> that was, uh, no context, context at all context. to that. No context at all. <laughs> <laughs> as like, is, as, sound like as, as, yeah. like, as your child just walked into the room or something exactly. that we ain't seen. Yeah. <laughs> you, you open that door one more time. Brad just stuck <laughs> in and like you know <laughs> picked a bogey uh, or something. Smash the like on the video, sake. guys. Evening, Shango V. Evening, yes, Shango, Shango V. Shango. Welcome in. Chatting away in Good the to see y'all. Prior to uh, going live, <laughs> he's done um, it again, Ash. Oh, there we go. Damn. Take down, but he can work off his back because Moreno. Right, I swear to absolute Vishnu, <laughs> if Moreno loses this, I'm going. Bro said right, Vishnu. I'm going. <laughs> wow, okay. Uh, in other news, Wales and Joe's is in the house. Is A all right, lads? Yes, Wales. Oh, man. How are you doing? What's up, Wales? Oh, What's good, bro? How doing? Was Welcome good. on in. Evening, Aaron. Welcome yes, on in, Aaron. Aaron. Traps, he says. Ash's best yeah, mate. Jets. Um, yeah, he's my best mate. <laughs> yeah, he's my best mate. Uh, going, going to the baths in Budapest with me and his missus. That's what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Cycle Paul says, uh, you going live for early prelims for 300, lads? Yes, we certainly are. Oh, yeah, we're going to give, we? give you all of it, mate. We'll give yes, all. we're going to give it a go. It's the going to be a jabam. struggle, um, but we'll hopefully have a fridge load of Monster Energy drinks and no, exactly. Uh, um, we take sponsorships things. as well, Monster. All oh, so those you numbers, know, you know I mean? Ash, don't look good. Yeah, they don't. They don't look good, do they? They do not look good. But um, oh, it's unanimous. Yeah, we, we, we're going to try and yeah, do what finishes. we can to stay awake next week. So stick around. Make sure you're there. Finally. Two points, two points, two points. Finally, The Rock has has come come back back. to (laughs) WrestleMania. (laughs) I think it was also the fact that um, he got some near finishes, didn't he? He nearly got him out there on a couple of rounds. Yeah, well, I was just saying salute to everybody. Shango V saying, Ash, mate, I've been jinxing the real faves all night. Yeah, mate, I I literally just said to the boys before we come live, before we get to the main card, I might just switch every single fighter I've picked because I'm having a mare. So, but I've got one right there, but 
to be fair, Morono, if he would have pulled it on a little bit there, I think I reckon he could have got a finish. He nearly got a he sub had a round two in round two. Didn't but he, I would yeah. have had three points. Uh, Court McGee's tough to, to finish. I knew it was going to be. He is. Yeah, he's a veteran. He, veteran of the he's game. Just he? joining us. Welcome on in. Hit that like button. Welcome yes. on in. And uh, of course, let yourselves known in the chats here. As I read them out, uh, Wales says, uh, get the beers in for 300s, lads. We're going to have some shots next Sweet. week. Um, shots, shots, I think that's going to keep shots, us going. Shots. Better Everybody. than the beers, because the beers will send us to sleep. Cully says, boys. Yes, hey. Cully. What's up, Cully? Uh, can Welcome anyone in, talk guy. to me about the Big Ben playing on Connor's video? Is that a London hint? I need opinions. I've not seen it. Is he in London right now? Oh, I've not seen it. Oh, wow. Okay. Cryptic. Cryptic. And go do your research, just find out. We've got no. the, our editors and everyone in the background working on that. I mean, it, it's just UFC in. 304, yeah, well, Cully. I think UFC 304 is going to be in London. It is going to be in the UK. Uh, I feel that what Manchester is the, strong, the likelihood option. Mm. 303 looks like it'll be the end of June. Because mm. judging from last year, we had two pay-per-views in July. Yeah. I think, be, but because they've brought International Fight Week forward, because that's going to be, I think, at the end of June, we're going to get three hundred three in June. That's my prediction. Mm -hmm. So we'll have two pay per views in June, and just we'll, the one in July, and the one in July will probably be Manchester. That's my yeah, thing. yeah. But again, don't forget to drop a like on the video anyway. Uh, for you legends. Yep, yep. Full uh, analysis over ooh. here. Uh, oh, wait, we will not be missing it, and you will be oh, fed full coming content. Coming soon with Big Ben playing. Hmm. Oh, is it really? Yeah, there's a lot of hints, mm. and I, I think we'll get an official announcement next week during the UFC 300 broadcast. It's got to be. They're not going to announce it um, prior to this one. Maybe, yeah. maybe the cryptic thing there is just the fact that they're going to announce it. Um... Yeah, the chime, yeah, at a certain time. I think yeah. that was probably what was in play. Mm, yeah. Maybe. But is, was Do there I... a picture or a clip of Big Ben? Because that's... That's telling. That would be, yeah. Ben. Do you reckon we'll get him on the uh, pay-per-view card over here? Breezy says, Do Big Ben. I doubt they yeah. would <laughs> do <laughs> Connor in yeah. London, somewhere in the US or Ireland. Yeah, you'd expect so. I mean, if they're going to do bring Connor over to London, you'd expect it to be... We can Stadium, into the fight card, shall we, lads? Yeah, we can do. Yeah, can do. Yeah. Um, let's uh, preview the main card then that we've got coming up. Originally, it was going to be six fights. Now it's going to be it five. Was. We've got down to five. It's been better for us. Yeah. Oh, I, mean, I think it was a good thing, really, because that walker yeah. Bretsky fight was a... Yeah. Uh, shambles as well. Like, how was. that? How Walker lost that fight, I would never I would have been absolutely peeved the fact that they put that on the main card and they don't even put Dumont uh, around the main on the main mm. card yeah I would have thought that would have been on the main card to be honest as well yeah. mate yeah but kicking things off on the main card though yeah Walker's they're kicking Ooh. things off we've got a barn burner we've got Trevor Peake taking on Charlie Campbell again that's going to be a great fight to be honest um, that, that's on the main card um, and then sticking it in the lightweight division we've got um, Bayer Mundes taking on Christos uh, Gigos Giagos. and then in the featherweight division we've got Morgan is it Shari Shari yep oh I don't know oh. Charlie <laughs> from Paris. Charlie from Paris. Yeah, indeed. Taking indeed. on um, Chape Mariscal. Chape Mariscal. <laughs> Chape Mariscal. And then uh, sticking with the paperweight division, we've got Alexander Hernandez taking on our boy Damon Jackson. And then in the main event, we've got Brandon Allen taking on our boy as well, Chris Curtis. Again, like I said last week, we had um, Julio Arce winning because he'd been on our channel. I, I even put a post out to say if any fighters and Mike Davis as well, sorry, from previous weeks. Um, if, if any fighters need a win or want to win, come on the channel. Yes, Damon Jackson's uh, going to win tonight. Chris Curtis is going to win tonight. Roll. Book them. <laughs> I felt confident before you said that. You know, I'm not going to. It's just because you've had a jinxing things, right? I have. I've, I've had a shocker. <laughs> Let's hope you just haven't done that. Let's hope you haven't done that. I rake in the points. Uh, if my points, but that, that's what I mean. You have a bad prelims and then bosh. Now, now it's party time, right? Party time. Party time. Now it's party time. Cully said. So, uh, potential fighter nights for everyone in the chats. And then JK, yeah, go yeah, read Yeah, Cully, uh, Cully said, Max it. also said there's an announcement at 300 Conference 2. Uh, yeah, I was referring to Max Holloway, I think. I think, yeah, there will be something big during the press conference. That'd be my guess. 
Um, we've also got uh, Cully saying Connor did say he wouldn't mind a three rounder to come back to. He's not going to be. He, he has to headline, isn't there's no doubt. Yeah, no, yeah, he's got a headline. Blake G got said, him. I thought th UFC 300 was today. Nobody, it's next week, but Stu, uh, stick around. Next week, mate, next week. Yeah. Uh, Cully yep. says he we could be, be on 303. That's June 29th, like he said. Uh, just a mm. cryptic thing to post. Shanga V saying Walker was awful earlier. A man clearly made of cakes. Um, <laughs> where else is Ash? The hair is looking sharp, mate. No homo. Well, it could be even sharper for 300 because our boy Sai did get back for it, but he's not going to do it. So, but, you know what I mean? It, it could be, it could be uh, even better it. for UFC 300. You tweeted it in the week. Are you actually, actually doing it? You know what I mean? Because I... you're not allowed, you're not allowed in HQ unless it's it's coming in blonde. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? I, 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 if we can get to 20 likes. No, here we uh, go. Oh, 20 man. likes on this video. Chops his pants for 20 yeah. likes. This guy uh, will do nothing at all for 20 <laughs> likes. <laughs> There's nothing he won't do for 20 likes. I know. <laughs> Guy pays easy. Uh, <laughs> nothing I wouldn't do for 20 likes, you know what I mean? Chewy <laughs> Makachev says, cheer lad. The bar is lad. truly low. Uh, would love to see Volta Walker versus Gaziev next. You know what, you're, you're probably right. Could yeah. be the next Mate, option. That is, you are spot Ooh, on Chewy with Makachev. that fight. You really Bring are spot on with that one. We'll send it. Shango saying, I've got Campbell round two KO next. All right, let's get yeah. into the breakdown. Right. A, quick, a quick one about that. Potential fight of the night, boys. What do you reckon that was? Easy, one? this one. <laughs> yeah, you reckon it's, it's Trevor Pete then. This one you're most excited don't, about. Let's move on. Don't go past go. <laughs> don't get collect 200 pound. Yeah, you know what I mean? Exactly. We don't want that 200 bills. We're, we're, we're stopping here, mate. All right, cool. There we are. <laughs> we do this first fight, then we'll log off. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, this is this is that geezer that, that um, I think to DC Jim, uh, in his post-fight press conference asked um, asked DC to ask him a question, and it, and then he interrupted him and did like it doesn't matter what you think, <laughs> did he? It doesn't matter what you think. Yeah, that, it's so cringe. It was so I didn't cringe. see that. Oh, right. No, you know. Um, anyway, jumping on to the cringy Charlie Campbell. He's got a record Cannibal. of eight wins with two losses, with six KOs and three first-round finishes. He does have a UFC record of one win and zero losses. He made his UFC debut in 2023. Also, he's on a Dana White Contender Series in 2022, and he's currently on a two-fight win streak. Yes, indeed. Now, he's an orthodox fighter, pressure fighter, indeed. Uh, you can expect a lot of forward motion from this guy. Rarely does he play it safe. Sharp accuracy with straight punches right down the pipe, too. And he's got this excellent shot selection when he's in the pocket. Often, he turns his whole body into his punches to generate that power that he needs in order to get the job done. But otherwise, he's got a bit, plenty of wind-up in his uppercuts and his kicks as well. So they're kind of readable if you if you wise up to him. But he doesn't just headhunt this guy. Like, he'll mix up his strikes by attacking the body first before going up top. But he's really effective with those knees in the clinch too. So keep an eye out for those. So jumping on to the always exciting so far, Trevor Peak. He's got a pro record of nine wins with one loss with eight KOs and he does have six first round finishes and he has a UFC record of two wins and one loss and he made his UFC debut in 2023. Also as well, the same as his opponent, uh, been on Dana White Contender Series as well as in 2022 and he has never been KO'd or submitted. Could that go tonight, lads? Ooh, could very well do, could very well do. But he's an orthodox fighter, he comes forward with explosive hands, has the tendency of throwing wild punches from the off, always the hammer, never the nail. He's at yeah. his best when he fights in punching range. He mixes up his offenses by finishing his combinations with an uppercut. Very durable and tough to knock down. This guy loves to feel the energy of the crowd, but often gets too carried away. So far, it worked yeah, well for true. him. He did kind of like um, pull back on the pressure a little bit in that last fight, though. Mm. So he made some adjustments um, since his, his first loss. Um, he's good in the tight clinch as well. He generates a lot of torque on those knees to the body. So better watch out for that as well. For Charlie Campbell, though, um, for those of you who don't know, he could have been moments away of putting out Chris Duncan on the Contender Series. You know, he had yeah. Duncan hurt. Yes. At least, you know, on two occasions during that fight um, and got really unlucky, really. It was uh, Chris Duncan who got the, the TK, which well, just knocked him dead, to be fair, with a straight right. Yes, mm. look at this WrestleMania, man. Love it. WrestleMania! <laughs> I can't believe it's now like a two-day thing. Yeah, I, 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 I was just saying that like to um, someone at work the other day. That they, um, 
Like since when was it two days? Like what is it today I've and tomorrow? Is it? it? Yeah, they do yeah. Two I've months. always known it just to be the Sunday, but anyway, yeah. I don't want to talk too much about it. But no. But okay. uh, yeah, what can we expect? I'm making it'll be in the octagon by the time we get back from this advert break. Sure. What can we expect right. from Charlie Campbell? Okay, so over in the blue corner, I reckon he's going to pull back from those wild strikes he throws and just try to catch him on the counter every single time. This. It's probably something Mariscal had a lot of success with. So like Peak, Campbell will probably throw his whole entire body into his punches. And then he kind of often does it once he's backed his opponents up, to be fair, making this fight an excellent choice to open up the main card, I reckon. But it, it could come down to who's able to connect the first and or who's able to do it the fastest and who's able to do it with the most damage. Overall... Yeah. Campbell does need to focus more on being the most accurate fighter out of the two yes. and not let Peak draw him out into the firefight. He needs to use his straight punches just to set up those hooks. Um, and I think that could be money for him. Yeah, and as for Trevor Peak then, um, who is an inch smaller, um, he fell short hey man, in the wrestling need to shame him against like that. Um, Chape Pariscal, who's going to be on the card later on tonight. But uh, seemed to do a better job with his uh, in his last fight, as I mentioned uh, previously. I think it could be something he falls back on uh, should he fail to connect first against Campbell. Um, I think he needs to be a zombie and just keep coming forward, eating everything Campbell throws. He did show more control over his output in his last fight, but I think that was because he needed to deal with the heat. Um, uh, over in Abu Dhabi, whereas of course this this time we're in Vegas. So um, you know, I think maybe either man could bring out the dog in in each other in this one. But yeah, uh, no, very true. I do agree that I think Campbell's going to be a bit more precise, which is the reason why I think I've gone yeah. for a Campbell knockout in this over Trevor Peak. Who? Oh lord! Yeah. Oh lord! Who else there have you is. got? I've gone round two KO for peak. Or peak. Uh, guys in the chat, so who have you gone for? I've um, gone peak. Shango V says peak is another fighter that looks like a PS2 game create create uh, create character starting hair and default goatee beard too. Yeah, <laughs> it looks a bit more like UFC Lego version. Indeed, uh, Breezy says that's how I feel standing next to you guys. Let alone how Angus feels uh, like <laughs> being. In the Shire, I think he's been one inch reach. Oh, being really time. tall. <laughs> yeah, I went for round one, Charlie Campbell. Oh, Ross Clark. Yeah. Yeah, boy. Just we are in. Get the job done. Circling around, trying Trevor to find Pete's his entries. He is a menace. Got uh, Campbell opening up with <clears> kicks <throat> early. Yeah. Going low and then going high. Sync us up with the timer if you can. Not bad from Campbell. Oh, snap right. that kick. Yeah. Oh. Campbell's doing well. Open up with those kicks. Touching the body, touching low, touching high. He's got a very good section of kicks there from kicking range. So far, Peek hasn't thrown a single oh. shot. Not Slip sure there. there. Oh, uh, did he throw a kick there? Looked like, a, looked like a one shot drop. Ooh, working the body now is Campbell. He and is. Resorting to, to long drain weapons. Peek, Peek now looking to get some kicks. back of his own. <laughs> Oh, another one. Yeah. Peak's getting frustrated. He is a little bit, don't, I think, but... Don't want him to get frustrated. But Peak will unload think... when he's against the cage. And so far, Campbell's yeah. doing a really good job with his footwork. Yeah, touching the outer leg. Oh, another... Oh, Peak oh, letting go. it go there, but some good blocking there from Campbell. What Peak needs to be doing is countering these kicks. He does. A bit better. Ooh, Catching him. A... Oh, oh here we go. Okay, and knees. they clinch up. Didn't expect it to be like this, but yeah, I'm not sure who's going to win in these, this scenario, to be honest. Peak has got some good wrestling to his game. He does. You know, it's not too bad. I think we've seen it shades of it in the previous fight. And we said yeah, he could fall that, back actually. on no, it. I, I did see him actually on top in the last fight. You just reminded me, actually. Mm. Trying to get a trip. Mm, not happening. So, no, it's not. Mm. Good, good defense from uh, Campbell. Yeah, yeah he needs so to really so go for a bit more of a throw. Oh, he needs to get in front of that lead leg and just throw him over his hip. Campbell's showing a good base so far. He is. He really is. And 
Ooh, some stomps okay, in there. Classic from... foot stomps. Yeah. They were aggressive. Do you remember them back in the noughties? When... Foot stomps. Back when... Uzi... Ah, and he's oh, down. He down by the body lock. Nicely done from Trevor Peak. Mmm. It's been a Ooh, while since he's to the body he's now. Yes. Found his feet oh, again. Nicely done. I'm very Campbell surprised why fighters feet. don't do that, to be honest, lads. Foot stomps. Like, well, knees to the body. Foot stomps yeah. and the knees to the body as well. I see vintage, knees to the body. Uh, Kamara Usman. Usman used to do him quite a bit, didn't he? Yeah, I see him a bit. Yeah, foot stomps, yeah. Foot... Yeah. Oh my goodness. Shango reckons that the he th thought the odds were a little harsh on Peak, to be honest. Yeah, they look uh, steep. Yeah. I, don't know, I think it's just because Trevor Peak's so wild and Campbell, like JK said earlier, is so precise. He yeah. gasses. He gets a bit tired. And look, he's a bit tired he now. Digs after. So wild, though, he like, digs deep and so gets wild. through it. He does. Yeah, true. He's, he looks a bit, a little bit breathing heavy off the back of that wrestling exchange. Oof. Nice. Oh my goodness. Oh, geez. Wow. Oh, he's punched him through the door. Landed, really. That was a low blow. Looked like it. And Campbell turns to... Knees Campbell. Great Ooh, knees good to knee. body, yeah, Really Campbell. good. It's been a close round. Back on the outside There's that leg kick. kicks. Yeah, look at that. Oh, nice wow. good guard from Campbell. Very good. Great combo. Went high. With the left Ooh, kick. Oh, again. Ooh, Whoa. Shovel into Uppercut orbit. Uppercut from Campbell there. Could have been dangerous. Devastating if it connected. Oh, that was nice. He's opening up, though. Campbell is coming alive. He is. He probably senses Oof. the peak's tired. Yeah, yeah I can see good it. Body kicks as well. Oh, I've got one minute left to get a TKO. But uh, I don't Good think kicks. there's going to be a finish in this round. Oh, I don't know about that, mate. <laughs> oh, it's going to speak too, too soon. Oh, man. Oh, my goodness. Sure. Is that just tiredness? That's the thing. Tri oh, madness. Peak's thrown wild, but Campbell's getting out of the way yes. every single time. Chomp, chomp, chomp from Jesus, Campbell. Jesus, these kicks, man. Yes. Oh, good teep. Yeah, nicely done. So sternum there. I don't know what's good for, for Peak being up against the cage and being like just offloading mm. from off the back foot Oof. or Campbell, the one that's going to throw the Ooh. precise shots. Oh, 10 seconds Ooh, left. God, yeah, no, nicely shots. done, Campbell. This is important to steal the round. Knees. Yeah, I think he's won the round anyway. Yeah. Reckon. Campbell 1 0 up. Yeah, yeah Campbell 1 uh, 0 up. Not recruiting. Smash like on the video, guys. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I, did, uh, I did round one knockout for Tim Peak. Like yeah, I think. Tim Peak. <laughs> <laughs> Tim Peak. <laughs> Peaky. Peaky blinder. Yeah. I hope he throws a couple of blinders in this next round. Exactly that, Mr. Brown. Exactly that. Come on. <laughs> you know. Shango says... Have a little rest, uh, have a little rest Peak. Have a little rest. <laughs> Commentator's Come right saying Shango. Campbell needs to time his approaches a little more as Peak's just throwing. Yeah, I, I mean... I can hear Peak breathing from here. He's, <laughs> you, you're right in saying that. I think he... Um, Campbell was starting to find his rhythm and his timing yeah. towards the end of that round. You could really see it. So I think you're expecting the same again from Campbell. He just needs to... Go second and, and wait for Peak to load up, basically. Peak's tired. He is. So much more so than Campbell. He's breathing, uh, Campbell's breathing heavy a little bit, but yeah, Peak's, yeah. Gaethje in the house. Gaethje, and then uh, there, there he is, Diego Lopez. Diego Lopez. Oh, oh, yeah. Can't wait for the fight against Sadiq next week. Is that Breezy on his oh, right? I'm going to be so nervous, <laughs> man. It's Breezy about a beard. So nervous. <laughs> is that clean shaven <laughs> Breezy? <laughs> Sorry, that was a bit. That was a bit racist of me. You guys just had the same glasses. That was it. <laughs> racist. <laughs> glasses. 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 <laughs> Here we go. Round number two. Oh my goodness, Pete! Right. Calm down, <laughs> sir. <laughs> he peeks too Calm quickly, down. don't he? Peek too quickly. Oh, oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> it's just like all over the gaff, Beyblading. Yo. But he's oh Pete doesn't want a third round. Forcing the exchanges here early in round two. Mate, keep keep I think I think he's not gonna get this takedown, I don't think. I think I think Campbell's gonna be wise to it and probably get a takedown or a toss uh, toss of his own here. Make a brawl, mate. Make a brawl, don't do the wrestling because the wrestling tired him out after the first round. Yeah, I'll knees keep... to the body and then again pick pick Oh Ooh, that was nice. Beautifully done. Oh them leg kicks Oh, three in a row. Damn oh it. man. But Peek is just Wow, he kept his, on his feet there. That was nice. Yeah. 
Get out of these exchanges. Uh, Abacat's coming. Shango. Blind knee. Oof. Nice right hand. Chomp oh, chomp. mate. He's going to go high with one of these in a minute. Yeah. He's tired. He's working the body as well. Oof. Campbell's doing well. Campbell's good, but Then again, man. it works for Pete being like a bit of a brawler because Campbell's the more technical striker, making him sort of throw wild shots in these brawl scenarios. Yeah, he needs to just catch him, though. It's all right if you're, you've not got great foot, footwork, though. Come on, Pete, get a takedown. Come on. No, you don't want to take down. You just want to bash, bang him against the fence. Bash him. <laughs> bash him there. Bash him up. Balls to the wall, mate. That's what you want. I just saw he just tapped. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely saw a tap. Oh, the tap. Retirement. His hands are together. Come on now. Where's the, where's this trip? Mm, not going to work enough. for it. Got to work for it. Here it is. Not bad. Love that. Explode. Here comes the. Here comes them. Bosh. Oh. Takedown oh. from. Is that desperate though? Campbell. Was that, was that a desperate takedown? It was, but to be fair, it was timed because yeah. Pete was just so off balance. Yeah. Nicely done from Campbell, mixing things up. He's a here. wrecking ball, Peak. He's a wrecking ball. And he's probably going to give up a position here just to get back to his feet, probably, guaranteed. Saying that Peak's, Peaks just like that. Yeah. It got guaranteed. him some, there we go. some fans, mind you, in his debut. But now Charlie Campbell's got the back. He's going to try and flatten him out. Probably could get, he's probably going to get the finish here. He's going to try and sub him. This would be, who mm. would have thought? Charlie Campbell pulls off the sub. Yeah. Nobody would It's just because Peaks just so relentless. Yeah, he's peaked already. We really? <laughs> Already made that joke. Already made that joke. Yeah. Breezy saying that leg is mangled. Come on, Peak. Go on, he's got that leg off. Yeah. He go he on. He's, could, in uh, no, uh, he's in no position mm, to do anything. Oh, guess. I don't no. know what you. I don't know what you're looking at, Ash. Yeah, <laughs> mate. Charlie Campbell's. Just... What are you on about? Peak. You on about or Campbell? Yeah, peak. He's he's in Campbell's danger. One hook in at the moment. Go on, geez. What? He's in danger. What are you on about? He's worked. He's worked his way out of that, and he's back to his feet near enough. There we go. We're back to his oh, feet. Here we there go. go. Here we go. Yeah. Oh. Like yeah. Well, you say that now, but I mean, in the moment, I was like, I don't. I don't know. You say, go on, geez. He's getting more and more into. Ah! Oh, oh, come on. He's, this is desperate. Fire. Fire. Oh. Bombs away. Bombs away. Bombs away. <laughs> Bombs away. Bombs away. Bombs away. Pete could drop some bombs here. Now you can say it. Come oh, on, son. Man. Come on, Pete. <laughs> Campbell drops Two levels one. to go Wait. for a takedown one. again. <laughs> one. But fails. Oh. oh, he's eating one. Campbell firing back now. Res oh, oh, oh man. Oh, no, Campbell's on the offense. But oh, Pete drags oh. him down to the ground. Oh, Come on, Peak. Has Peak got the energy to finish this, though? Finish him. Campbell needs finish. to... 30 seconds. Get up. And get Balls out. Balls to the like, wall, Peak. Up, 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 up. He, to be honest, he could have finished it there, but he just doesn't have the energy. No. no. That power bar is drained. Yeah, that power bar. Oh, That's it back knees off. to the body oh, from oh, Campbell. These knees, these knees are nice. Yeah. Oh, they're both tied. Now they're both tied. Oof. Oof. Yikes. Oof. Yikes. Oh, my Lord. Oh my lord. Campbell connecting here. <coughs> I still think that's 2 0 Campbell. You reckon? I mean, Pete made it really competitive there. It could have been the most significant moment of that round. So who knows what the judges scored here? But going into this third round, now that Campbell's tired, Pete will dig deep even more, if you know what I mean. Yeah, it's going to come down to yeah. good. mental toughness and grit here. Yeah. But the thing is, is Campbell's still like landing very well. Oh, he He's just is, yeah, not true. got any enough power to like do much jam damage. Yeah. So, you know, he's still scoring big. Oh, dear. Do you think Peak's got power in the third, though, either? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Trevor Peak's got Ooh. Dwayne Ludwig in his corner. Never do that. Dwayne Bang Ludwig. All to play for, perhaps, in this round yeah. three. Uh, uh, Shango says, I say 2-0 Campbell. Round yeah, three is going to be quick out the blocks for peak. What do you reckon in the chats? Do you think it is 2-0 to Campbell or is it 1-1? One, one? 
Mm. Most significant moment that, that round I think came by the hands of Peak, though, I think. I thought as well, so... Yeah, but he had him, he had him in a bit of a rear naked choke danger, Campbell, didn't he? That's true. So I don't know if you want Flexing to class that as... Uh, yeah. Goes to Campbell. True. So then you go to if aggression it was just that and octagon control. Oh, nice Ooh. one, Peak! Oh, Get your leg out of there. Oh. Campbell. Oh, no! Is wise to it. Oh, he's going to go for a guillotine. Uh, no, bail. Find your feet, bruv. Oh my god, this peak is a He's monster. just literally keeps coming forward. Just call him the redneck zombie. <laughs> Guys are relentless. <laughs> but who? Oh yeah, we want we want Charlie Campbell to win for the post-fight speech. I think it'll be quite interesting. Yeah. Or knees, knees yeah. peak. Oh, foot stomps. Break them toes. Break them toes. <laughs> Could we get a first TKO win from from foot stomps? No wonder. Ooh, oh, just missed with that gosh. elbow over the top. Oh. See, aggression Going for from the pedigree. Peak. Not sure what this Ooh, is day. going on here. What can we do from this? Yeah, yeah, he's like, oh, I'll take that. <laughs> yeah, I'll fucking have that on. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, yeah, I love that. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you doing out there? On the ground, like. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I love how he saw that. I, I'll take that. <laughs> oh, just, did you see the frustration with him? He just went. Sake. He knew. Uh, yeah, he yeah. Knew he effed up there. And Campbell's going to look to take the back again. Oh, it's too I high. Think it's too high again. Too high, but he needs to adjust that far hook. Oh! Oh, oh my God! Get a roll. Oh, oh! And nicely adjusted from Campbell. He's on the back. Still on the back. Mate, this is just such an emotional roller coaster. Peak. It is, mate. I'm oh. having a hard time. We've got One minute, triangle here. Jordan's side of the sofa is going, wow! And then it's mine, and then it's Jordan's, and then it's mine. And we're both. I don't think uh, Campbell's got enough energy I think to. He's got his arm trapped. Oh, no. No. Lost it now. For a second, I thought Peak was punching himself. <laughs> yeah, screw it. <laughs> was just... I thought he had the red gloves on. It just looked like he was. He has got the red gloves on. He just looked like he was punching Here himself. We... Is it under the chin? I don't think so, no. no. Not quite. No. It's going to be such a struggle to try and pull this off now. It's got two minutes, two and a half minutes to work, though. I think we might get peak yeah. escape using the break, uh, using the feet here to break the lock. Oh! oh sorry, and an arm jump. From, from Mount, but... He cries, he's dead. <laughs> he yeah. looks like he's crying. Man, he's not moving. <laughs> He's not quite got the squeeze on him, on it. He's not moving. Is he hurt? Is he all right? Yeah, he is. He's going now, but... Is he just <sighs> waiting for Campbell to explode and then adjust? Come on, lad. Here we go. No. Uh -oh. Campbell sits back. Submission. Oh, no, he's out. No, nice. fight the elbow. Nicely done from, from Peak. Nice. Oh, yeah, he breaks the legs. Oh, he's up. God. Mate, just, just, took the seat, just took the seatbelt off like that, didn't he? Unbuckle that. And Charlie down it goes. Oh try and drag God, him down again. Down defense. It's all right nice there. Done. Can't score points for that, unfortunately. No. you got to turn and bang him, Peak. I'm wondering how the judges really score this fight. I mean, so far yeah, this round, Campbell. Oh, it's all Campbell. Campbell. It's Campbell. Probably one and three at most, but, you know, could be 30-27. Yep, nice. Get out of there. Oh, Peak now needs to just balls to the wall. Whoa! Oh, Ooh, I Campbell love that. He's just not, got, he's not ah, got enough energy no. to get out of there, is he? No. no, he's wasted it all trying to get out of these positions. Yeah. Good, good show from Campbell though. I think we've nice. uh, we've learned a lot about his grappling in this fight. We said it'd be a good fight as well. Yeah. Nice. Been back and anything forth. other than great fight. Yeah. Is Campbell trying to set up an arm? No. Peak looking to get back to full guard. So far he's locking down the Front leg. Front arm bar. Peak. Half guard for, for Campbell now. Is he sleeping? His eyes 20 closed. seconds left of the <laughs> round. Dreaming. <laughs> he's dreaming. <laughs> Guy's breathing heavy. 
Uh, Shango saying Campbell used a lot of gas with the holds. He definitely yeah. did. He's still capable of switching through transitions Whoa. here. There it is. That could be it. No, a bit late. Bit yeah. late, but... Uh, Take the rounds. Looking like that. Take the rounds. Good, good fight. Good back and forth scrap. I think Campbell's taking that without a doubt. Campbell's yeah. done some training with Aljo um, as well. Yeah, actually, yeah. Um, so that's probably why the camera's hand over to him and Marab in that corner. He's been out of that gym training historically in the past. Well, he's good. Guy's good. Yeah, we definitely learned quite a bit from him about Campbell in that fight. And mm. of course, oh, yeah. close to getting the Dana White Contender Series nod. But got knocked out by Chris Duncan. Yeah. He's definitely yeah, shown some just, levels. Just have a little look at Aaron's bet. It's a cheeky one. Oh, yeah, he sent sent one through. <laughs> cheeky one. Yeah, I've only got one. I've, my backup bet is uh, in play now because Pete lost. Oh, so. I see. Backup bet to the backup bet. Yeah, exactly that. Shaka saying I all, will always watch a Pete fight, always a war. Yeah. But I think, uh, you know, he's now, what? Two and two now in the UFC. Yeah. Uh, what, uh, yeah, yeah. Got to start got, being a bit more technical in there, I think. They need to give him a winnable one. Who would be a winnable fighter? Another debutant? Debutant? Probably. But they're kind of unpredictable debutants. They they can come in mm, steamrolling. Probably. Given that guy, Conor McGregor, we beat him. <laughs> give yeah, him McGregor's. Show. I reckon... <coughs> Well, our fans, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. Charlie Campbell. Yeah, good fight. Good winner, winner, chicken dinner. Yeah, round two was close, but uh, I, I, I missed the scores. Uh, maybe I'll kick it up on Twitter. Redonkulous pace, man. Yeah. What's he going to say? Oh, God. Yeah. What's he say? Nice. Ah, very respectable. Yeah. Here for it. I'm here for it. <laughs> Need a bit of cringe. I haven't seen it in a while. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, I missed the scores. Damn it. Uh, it was unanimous, but yeah, but did all three judges score at 30 27 or was it 29? DDT from Trevor Pete there. That was. Uh, come on now. That's a rebel of that. Oh. Nine and two now. Two and zero in the mm. UFC. Oh. All right, mate. <laughs> Stay <laughs> Portnoy. Shout out to. Oh. Is that about that Ryan Garcia thing? No, no, I don't think so. Tim Tebow's doing some charity. Um, yeah, I'll uh, I'll take the uh, the one point on Campbell there. I want to meet um, Mrs. Peaches. How many people went to... <laughs> Who you got to call out? I want to meet your wife. Um... <laughs> Such a random... Really random, random call, out. call out. Call out his wife on Zoom. Oof. <laughs> Banger alert coming up, guys. Make sure to put your predictions in the chats. Yeah. And um, let us know how how you're doing so far on, on the points. Oh, I don't, I don't even want to look, lads. I don't even want nah, to look. No, nah, let's, let's just decide not to uh, touch we that bag. to find out how many people <laughs> went for Trevor Peak in that. Let's just decide now. And not open that. Let's just, just not have a little look. Let's just, get, let's just keep it quiet. I've not been lads. looking for the last three weeks, bro. <laughs> a car crash. An absolute car crash. 
Well, you, you, you have all oh, full, full duty to have a have a go at me because I always take the mick out of you. Mate, you're probably still doing better than me. That's the problem. So I'd still have no leg uh, to stand. Shanga and I are level on points. Harris is one point above. Sean, MMA I'm nine, all the way down in ninth away. with two points. That is two. Genius. Okay, I've got to be above you. Surely I've got more than two. Yeah, yeah you're above me. You're above with me. Three points. <laughs> Probably. My lord, man. Oh, bro. So agreed. Like you guys said, peaks two and two. He's lacking uh, the more technical side. Imagine if he had that, was less reliant on full on aggression. The advertising of WrestleMania. Uh, he's got bar heart via... Yeah, it's sub. mad, that, isn't it? But no, they're in cahoots, though, aren't they? That's why. Yeah. They advertise WrestleMania. They're in partnership. Yeah, but they're... they're oh, of course. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that makes sense. I just, I just wondering because that's going to take eyes from here to there now because that's... Yeah, meh. But, you know, one dream, one team, so... Nah. <laughs> Is it? It's it's paper, live on pay-per-view, isn't it? Welcome to the hot Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, I've gone for Herb Dean um, to win the next fight. Uh, the next one's going to surprise the one. I think I've gone for the underdog in that. Vegas, yeah, yeah, a bit of a Gilles. beast. Vegas. Yeah, I, I kind of had to. I mean, Baja Mondes could come out there and completely surprise us. Um, I can't believe Gigos just, is an extreme underdog. That's mad. Yeah, he's a bit relentless. Um, I think it could look a bit like the uh, last fight that Baja Mondes had against Ludovic Klein. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, Klein's a bit of a beast. And he's a bit of a pressure dude. As dangerous as Bahamandas is, he hasn't utilised working behind his jab, and I feel that will let him down again tonight. Everyone got in the chat. Yeah, uh, Daniel Zaluba beat um, Giagos last time out. Anaconda choke. That Zaluba. My Anaconda hook. My Anaconda. Uh, and then prior to that, Giagos beat Ricky Glenn first round knockout left hook. But then before that, he lost against Tiago Moises and Armin Sarukian. So, and they're both tough dudes. So, yeah. Yeah. Baja Mendes, though, on the other hand. The exciting fighter as well, Baja Mendes. Beat Trey Ogden before losing to Ludovic Klein. Beat someone called Ron Zhu. Ron, Ron Zhu. Something like that. Bravo Choke. And of course, the wheel kick against Roosevelt Roberts, which was yeah. mad team. But yeah, Giagos, I think, has fought tougher dudes and potentially put on a wrestling yeah. display in this next one. That's true. Uh, and that could be obviously like striker versus grappler in this one, really. But Mendes does have good takedown defense, but is it mm. enough? Mm. He likes to hang out in the pocket, though, and that's where he's going to be at danger. Mm. Should we get into this one? Yeah, why not? Yeah, Let's do bring it, it down. Yeah, getting to uh, uh, Grigos then, uh, who's got a pro record of 20 wins with 11 losses, with eight KOs and four submissions. And he does have five first round finishes. Uh, and his UFC record, uh, record is six wins uh, with seven losses. And he made his UFC debut in 2014 and ha has one win in his last four fights. Yes, now the switch stance fighter keeps yeah. a very low center of gravity. Brown belt is in jiu-jitsu and he gets in your face from early. And he's quite relentless too. He's got that kind of takedown attempts, which he'll just keep pumping out there. He waits for you to commit, and then he kind of shoots at the hips himself. But he's very effective, and he's quick in the scrambles. He's capable of wrapping up quick submission attempts as well. Wrestling is definitely his best art. However, he'll probably tend to throw a lot of looping shots around the guard as well. So whilst he loves his wrestling, it's not his only tools in the bag. He'd, uh, jumping on to Baja Mundes then he's got a pro record of 14 wins with five losses with nine KOs and one submission and he, he has six first round finishes and his UFC record is three wins and two losses and he made his UFC debut in 2021 he's also been on Dana, Dana White Contender Series in 2020 and he has never been KO'd that's right and he's a switch on start fighter he's a tall lightweight fluidly mixes up his kicking attacks out of both stances and he makes it look effortless. Um, he prefers the low kick out of the orthodox stance and will target the body with from southpaw. Very good at using his range. And he is, uh, this comes when being a kick-orientated fighter. Punching-wise, I've noticed he uses the straight left 
to the body a lot when he switches to Southpaw. And to be honest, I think Baja Mondes training with Bilal Muhammad is not doing him any good. Ooh. That'd be my no, good takedown defense now. You'd expect so, but he got taken down quite a bit against Ludwig Klein, I think, last time out. Ooh. If I remember rightly. But um, but yeah, you know, you'd expect so. Expect him to be able to mix up his offense pretty well. True, um, true. But yeah, striking wise, I think he's not looked his best, mm. in my opinion. But who knows? Hopefully, he can put it all behind him in the next, uh, this next fight against uh, Crystal yeah. Giagos. Giagos, by the way, also lost against Charles Oliveira back in 2018, which they mentioned a second ago. Hmm. Some time How ago. far behind is that? <clears throat> is that feed on YouTube? How far behind is it? Uh, no idea. Ages. Oh, you're, 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 you're uh, live? not in, not even yeah. live for some reason. Hmm. That's yeah. better. Um, uh, Shango said, "I'm surviving off past glory in all-time leaderboard as I've had a very ropey prelims and mm. off by miles with methods." Checking the main leaderboard. Ropey yeah. sounds like a bit generous, Shango. Uh, no clue why I picked sub round two. Looking at it, Ooh. yeah, should get some expectations on the way. Oh Jesus, I'm all the way down in eighth for main leaderboard now. Jakers, yeah. Jakers. Oh, Sean's like out, out, out right uh, leader. Yes, he's got a few points above us now. Still very competitive at the top. Oh, he's a three hundred adverts. Is it going to be? On pay per view, no, it's not. Hmm. Oosh. Adverts all over the gaff work, mm. really doing something yeah, different. Look at that! All right, so some expectations. Yeah. Let's get through some. Um, so here in the blue corner, we're going to see um, Yagos is going to be up against another tall, rangy striker. So he would probably want to use his head movement and footwork to get in the inside and land his power strikes. Not something he's not used to. We've seen him do it before. We'd like to see him do it again. He had had some success with his overhand right and punching speed in the first round against Zell Huber, but yeah. he kept threatening the counter takedowns to ensure he, he ruled the striking terms. And I think that's going to have to be the case here. Like he may find counters profitable tonight because Bahamandas has a tendency to lean heavy on that lead leg and just play in the pocket. But ultimately, if he's using his wrestling as well, that could be be quite good. Yeah, he's got to chain his wrestling in yeah. with his strikes, I think, in this one. Yeah. Mm. yeah no, if, for example, if he's using extended combinations to close the distance and just masters grappling entries, that's an obvious way to kind of level change and reach the disadvantage or like sort of uh, level the uh, the fact that he has got to reach disadvantage here against a taller Ranger striker and just kind of put Bahamanders on mm. his back. That's... Uh, Level the playing field. That's what I'm trying to say. Active lightweight. Yeah, that's an interesting start. As for Bahamandes, then um, he got forced into the grappling exchanges in his last one and looked a bit discouraged in there. I'm hoping he can find his rhythm a lot sooner in this one. He needs to throw more kicks in in here, make it more of a kickboxing affair instead of a boxing one. Teeps to the body and side kicks. Uh, to the legs are the two weapons we've seen him use in the past. We've got to see him a bit more so in this time. Do a better job at working behind his jab in order to keep Giagos on the outside. Uppercuts would be useful tool to defuse takedown attempts and catch Giagos as he maneuvers into the pocket. Yeah. So, yeah, maybe even cutting off at angles as well but as he's throwing them. But um, What's also quite wise about his uppercuts is whether they land or not puts Giagos on notice. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, puts puts him in bay. Yeah, and you can get a bit of breathing space to telegraph. Yeah, I know, we, I know. We say it's easier said than done. Like throwing either an uppercut to just mm. prevent the takedown from time to time, or a, just a, a faint of a knee. Mm. Just let them know that you're aware. Mm. Here we go. Round one about to start. Here we go, and we're in. We're in. They touch gloves. Bahamanda is taking center early He's here. He's a giant. He is huge. Giagos just looks a weight class below here. Him, him versus uh, the Spanish Wrecking Ball would be a good one. That's good. Start good switches. Yeah. Whoa. Ooh. Big explosion from Giagos. 
He's going to have to put combinations together. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Expecting to land from four, five, and six. The first three may miss. Oh, mm. he caught it on two. Ooh. Ooh, five five back, he did, about. yeah. I think... How does he make lightweight? I don't know. Like Cuts off a limb, re six it back he's, on. That's not... He looks bigger than not, Jalen Turner, right? Yes. Like, he's in frame-wise. Yeah, he's got big legs. Oh, good wow. shot again. And here we go. And utilizing the jab here yeah. is Baja Mondes. Very good at using that range. Fainting the teeth with the front leg. Mm. Gargos going here for we go again. four leg kicks. <laughs> Spinning attack. And there's a level change. Got a single. Oh, nice. Got to bail on it. It's going high. He's out of cage. Nice. Bahamandes. Now those knees will come in handy for Bahamandes. Throwing them oh, knees. Look, at that. look how easy that was. Mate, he could just <laughs> lift his leg up a quarter of the way and he's at the head height of Yagos. Nice. He's out of there. Bahamandes does not want us to go to the ground. No. Oh, good job. Naturally using his God-given gift of length and reach. <laughs> yeah, I think he struggled against Oof. Ludovic Klein because Klein's probably... A, He's more stocky, isn't he? He's a bit stockier. He's got a bit more strength to him. Yeah, and 100% great. Gargos, I don't Ooh. think he's got the same level of strength Gosh. as Klein. Oh, oh, there's a wheel kick. Oh, and he went spin to the body that time. Have mercy. Man, this oh. is the Baja Mondes we wanted to see last yeah, time out. This is. And here we go. He's teeing off against the cage. Be friends. Doing very well here. Gargos is spinning all over the gaff, trying to re recuperate here. Giagos desperately needs a well time level change here. He's got to slow Baja Mondays down. How would you do it? He's got to grapple. He's got to go to the ground, isn't he? Ooh. What happened there? I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. I don't think anything happened. Is it your shoe? Ooh, would it be a, would it be a took is faint? No, I fr froze, I mean. Oh, right. uh, just your end. After that spinning wheel kick. <laughs> Up in there, blood. Oof. Yeah, we're still going. There's the teeps. We can see more Oh, and now Kiagos is landing with the hands. Better yeah, success. look at that. Wow. He's gone off. But Hernandez. He's gone off. As you, 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 you was off. Yeah, it just went off. Oh, damn it. Oh, right. what happened you, there? Did he buckle? You can't show it. It says it's offline. You turn the mic. Bring it on back. Bring it on back. Your stream. Yeah. Oh. I'm virgin go. On your virgin, it was down. Yeah, I did that to me earlier, and then I, well, I cleared clap, uh, cash, uh, tried to sign back in, and it wouldn't let me. Oof. Dude, I'm not offline. What are you on about? Why, how am I offline? What are you on about? Oh, oh, oh Baham Mondes with the oh, head kick stops wow. Giagos. I've, I've not even seen Whoa. it. I missed it. I missed Keep it. Keep quiet no. then, because <laughs> this man is on a tear. Bro. It, was clean. Believe it, lads. it was clean. I cannot believe it, lads. Bahamandes was like, Mate, I he was on one. Believe it. That is a, the type of performance we needed to see it, from boys. him. Wow. Bahamandes was like, someone's on the phone and for you. Be back in Bang. Doing morons. Oh, yes. Mate, mate. just been here. Time for the, for the replay. All right, that's the spinning, spinning. stuff earlier on. I'm, I'm watching it here. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Comes at him. Buckled in there with the straight oh right. Oh my lord. Master the range. The cage. That was earlier. Here it Two comes. Phone. Oh. Bang. Answers the phone. He almost went foot. to block, but he wasn't blocking high enough because that kick just caught the top of the dome there. I did, I did, I did actually say Oof. second round KO, so I take the it two got points. Through. For Bahamandes. Yeah. Oh I'll take two man. I'm going away from Giagos, but I had to judge it based on the last fight. Yeah. Bahamandes. Yeah, came he, out he, he was on a mission. He was indeed. Certainly showing those improvements from the last fight. It was really Some good. Chat. Shangri saying, I think the pay-per-view will be the UK event, possibly the Spanish one, uh, the one potential Connor one. That's rumoured whenever that Take will it. be. TNT and UFC have a four pay-per-view year <laughs> deal. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, I thought it was... I'm pretty sure it used to be two. So, um, yeah, we've not had one yet this year, I don't think. Um, nice. Uh, uh, this UFC one mate match making they 
cannot be the same division, surely. Aaron saying, holy effing lads, <laughs> this dude's kicks are, is insane. Right? Right? Shane is saying, wow, big kick. He only had to lift his foot a little to reach his head. Three points I don't against think that Aaron. Was Bob Mendes. You got three points again, Aaron? You're, no way. Like, what's your name, Harris? Uh, Aaron Harris Aaron's again with a three. Absolute mess. First point. Oh, Terry finish. By Hamondes. Mad. Shango saying again, why did I say sub? Man. Well, Oosh. there you have it. There you have it. Just like that. Bosh. Fair play to Baja Mendes. It's getting me hot, man. I'm not going to lie. That, def that wasn't Baja Mendes. He's a bigger guy. This is twin. Mm. Definitely came out a different guy from his last fight. Not bad. Man, UFC 80%. 300 is next week. That is mad. Man, one week away. Crazy. Oh. Cannot wait. We are going to be doing full live watch along next week. So make that, sure you've got the notifications bell rang. That's um that's one win in his last five now for Gregos. Yeah, it's time to go. Oh man. Whereas Bahamondes, what's his UFC record now? Ash? It was clean, um, crisp. Have a look. Welcome on in, uh, Harris. I must make, welcome, welcome him in. in. Welcome in, brother. Uh, oh, it's three wins, two losses. So it's four, four wins, two losses now. Ah, okay. Nice. Hey, man, look so, at this. Redemption art for Baja Mendes after losing against Lud Ludwig Klein. Oh, look, it's Harris is in. Yeah, Good I said brother. that. You're a bit late, bro. Sorry, but I was listening to his uh, victory speech. Is that a... Well, yeah, but I'm better Mohammed. Yeah. yeah. Oh, bro. Yeah, man, yeah, playing how much the man upstairs. So far, mate? It's Oof. been a bit of a shaky one this weekend, isn't it? Uh, Breezy says, uh, can't wait to be back, says Breezy. Mm. Yes. Sure. Uh, Aaron saying, I need Alexander Hernandez to win decision to get 240 quid. Ooh. Really? Damn. Mate, he's uh, a better, better, better than you, mate. Yeah. 240 What's, uh, pounds. What's your backup back saying now? Uh, I've gone for... Um, it is... Um, Jackson by submission. Is that it? No, ja uh, Jackson by uh, decision and uh, that French guy by KO. Sherry. Right. Uh, what have you put on? What have you put on? Uh, how much? Yeah. Oh, uh, two quid to get um, 60 back. So okay. it's not bad. All right, all right. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Not bad. Did you put 10p on that bet as well? Uh huh? Ooh, uh, he put Aaron. 10. Uh, oh, um, no, Aaron put Aaron. 10p on this bet. And he's up at 200. The original, the, no. Yeah, the original stake was two grand, but he would have won two grand if he'd have put a pound on it. Mm. It was um, Hernandez to win by decision, Bund uh, by Mendes to win by KO, uh, Alex Morono to win by KO or decision, uh, then that's Cesar Almeida to win by KO. West Ham to win and both teams to score. <laughs> Mate. And then, seriously, he had Charlie, Charlie Campbell by... Um, what an eclectic oh, mix of nice. decisions. That's mad. Welcome on in X Kid NX Show X, who says, as a Chilean, i got not much knowledge of UFC, but gassed about welcome my in, fellow in. Chilean doing great. Welcome yeah, on man. in, brother. Welcome Hit that subscribe on button. In. Hit a like on the video. This is a UFC fan channel where fan opinions matter most. Harris saying, not been a great night. Got a good amount of picks right, but wrong method of victory. Yeah. Yeah, struggling to get some methods uh, tonight. Aaron, Aaron's in 10 p for 240 that Five is crazy, pounds. Aaron. I hope that comes in, brother. You can't cash out now for something? You have to wait for this? I'm not sure that the cash out will be... Well, I don't know. If you're just waiting for a decision, maybe there might be about 50, 60 quid, maybe. A bit, a bit nervy. Shango has got Morgan via knockout second round. Yeah, so do I. I need, well. I need that as well. That and Jackson by submission. Come on. Jackson submission. Wow. Hmm. 
It's what he does, isn't he? It's what he does. It is what he does. Uh, it's not a bad bet. Alex Hernandez, I think, has only been submitted once in his career, and that was against Renato Moicano. There you go. Yeah. Stats out of the bag for you. So, yeah. Anyone this else got any bets? Let us know in the chats as well. And, Another of course, who you're predicting in this next fight. It's um, another promo. We've got yeah, promo going on at the moment for UFC 300. <laughs> Previewing or just showing us a bit of a highlight. Some of the... Yeah, here we go. We're going to have the them. amount of blooming highlights for UFC 300. We're going to see... Like, obviously, this is just 30 years of UFC. Yeah. The last promo showed... Yeah, it's just about UFC. It showed, like, the fights that never happened. So, Khabib and Tony Ferguson in the ring, which never mm-hmm. happened. It was, like, the, yeah, different pictures. It was, like... Tom and Aspinall in there with Frank Mir and stuff like that. Bit weird. Um, cash out doesn't work on Sky Bet for UFC FFS, says Aaron. Uh, it does, it does. Uh, I, I bet on Sky Bet. Uh, Remember, I had that bet last week, like, the week before, sorry, I cashed oh, out. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Must be the type of bet it is. Yeah, yeah, it must be the type of bet that you've got. Yeah, Frankie. Uh, Harris Frankie says again. Hernandez' decision is DC. a bit sticky, though. He's usually first round or bust, but good luck. Ooh. Yeah. Who's that, Jackson? Uh, no, he's on about Hernandez. Oh, yeah, that was Frankie. So Harris does his homework. You can tell. Ooh, Canada. Where's T at, anyway, speaking of Canada? Yeah, where is the Canadians at? Canada. Uh, yeah. Uh. I mean, he did beat Chills. Jim Miller by decision. Was that Kimbo Slice? Rest in peace. Yeah. He's got a glimpse oh. of him. Theod- um, Elias Theodora was there as well. Mm. R.I.P. Oh, yeah. Oof. I'll get on with it, lads. <laughs> yeah. This promo is long. It is long. Different from the last yeah, one. Yeah, it's long-winded now. I, I, I'm lost. Brock Lesnar. John Jones being the youngest champion ever. The uh, headshot dead. Rolling through the eras. Yeah, oh, it's that. inconsistent. Anderson what I don't like about Chael it. Sonnen. What I don't like about it, that flicks from past to present. Just give us a synced storyline. Give me a storyline going through the years. Don't go forwards, back, forwards, back, forwards, back. It's like, it's confusing. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rush. Wow. Wow. Bosh. So many promos. Baby J. There we go. Man, few okay. UFC 300 has given so much joy to so many. Not 300, UFC full stop. It's given so much joy to so many, and 300 will continue to do the same as well. Uh, Shango's got round points. one knockout for Hernandez. Mm, I feel like that's so likely, but. They got 12 current or former champions on that card. Gosh. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Stack City. To the rim. I wonder if they counted... Are they uh, playing the old... Uh, I wonder, they've got to do like a special intro for it as well. Yep. We'll be, we'll be rocking up and our, like very, our very best <laughs> for it. <laughs> Oof. Oof. Heck, get that. Mike Goldberg back in there, man. Just for one night. Tears, beautiful. Give him the prelims with Rogan. Just, just, just because. Well, who's got to step down if? Uh, uh, oh, I see. So who would he replace? Uh, it would probably be John Anik. And then you get Anik doing the main card. Yeah, yeah. That's what I would do. That's what I would do. Yeah. So. Do love Anik though. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's he's the best in the biz. The best there for is. For sure, for sure. Best in the biz. The best there is. Mm-hmm. And I carry everybody. I need to get that kettle on. Yeah, can't wait to uh, chalk it up this week about this card. There's yes. a lot to get through, lots to talk about. There was a conversation about Kayla Harrison making weight, wasn't there? Whether anyone thinks that would be possible. Sorry about that, boys. Yeah, I, th- I think you're right. What's this? Oh, I see. Yeah. Probably doing a bit of a wrestling thing. Oh dear! <laughs> oh, yikes, Pizza Sanko! Yikes, Sanko! 
Man. Yeah, it's wild what they get up yeah. to. That's what that's that's what it's gonna be like with us. Oh, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Get the cream pies in. Wait, should we get into this one? Sorry, I think it'd be a good idea. Yeah, let's break it all down. And up next, break it down now, brother. Sherry. Yeah, Sherry. Uh, Sherry. 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 Anyway, he's got a pro club. Fifteen wins with six losses with seven KOs and, uh, and three submissions. And he does have five first round finishes. And he has a UFC record of two wins and zero losses. And he made his UFC debut in 2023. And he's on a five fight win streak. And also he's never been submitted. Okay, now yeah, this is Shepe Mariscal here in the blue corner. So he's an Orthodox fighter, certified freestyle brawler, I'd say. Like he's got his very quick hands and he's actually great at finishing his combinations with those low kicks too. Now, he does prefer to do his best work in close. Um, this is where he can actually land short power hooks of his. He does look to attempt the hip throws when he's clinching up against the cage with his opponents. He broke Jack Jenkins' arm from it yeah, as well. If you remember that fall, it was nasty. Yeah, I gnarly. couldn't watch it. Sorry, a second ago. Ah, ah. Look, to get his, he'd do whatever it takes to get his opponents down, basically. But he's got his explosive entries as well. Well-formulated combos that sort of flourish off the back end of that. Targeting low, then finishing up high. It actually go balls to the walls that we've been saying for most of us tonight as well when he smells blood in the water because this guy is just hungry for a finish if he can if he if he sees any remote sign of it bang he's on it that's right dude so jumping on to morgan then he's got a pro record of 19 wins with nine losses with 11 ko's and three submissions and he does have eight first round finishes and his UFC record is uh one win with zero losses and he made his UFC debut in 2023. He's also on a four-fight win streak, and he's never been KO'd or submitted. I think it's Morgan Cherrier, I think, isn't it? Cherry, Cherrier, yeah, if you like. Um, and he's an orthodox fighter, buoyant and explosive striker on the feet, manages uh, range very well with his relentless forward pressure, although he can be a bit tentative at times, uh, picking and missing windows of opportunity. Throws a lot of feints and feeds off of the reaction from his opponents during, uh, sorry, before he counters. Vicious calf kicks capable of destabilizing opponents. Some of the best we've seen in bantamweight. Very quick in the grappling exchanges. Prefers to get top position so he can rain down the ground and pound. That's right. Yes, uh, Harris says he's got Kettle. on for the underdog in Mariscal. Woo! Are you have? No, Harris has. Oh, okay. Um, the last pirate, Morgan Charrier, says Aaron. Yeah, I mean, I can see where uh, Mariscal decision would make sense. Because there have been times where Morgan Charrier just kind of hasn't really got going. He's been a bit too tentative. He's let the, the fight run away with him really uh, and he's lost on the, the judges scorecards he's lost against um, uh, Jordan Vachenik in, in Cage Warriors really? yes uh, I think it was a split uh -huh. decision he'll be in the UFC soon and I think he's also lost against Paul uh, Hughes as well I was about to say when's, when's Paul Hughes fighting because obviously he, he beat Vachenik didn't he he did yeah Is it, when's he like, I've not seen him since he beat Vachenik uh, do you know what? I actually don't know. Um, I might be able to get that. But his talent as well is 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 good. Like, uh, I think Lucenic could be in the UFC soon. I, I've, I can't wait to see Lucenic in the UFC. Um, yes, yeah, same with um, same with Molly's boy as well. Um, Will Curry. Will Curry. Yeah, yeah. He's nearly there. He's knocking on the door. He keeps uh, evolving. Maybe two, three more. I'd say. But uh, yeah, nineteen wins and nine losses. Uh, Paul Hughes. Should I quickly get the expectations? Uh, Paul Hughes. Oh, where did you come from? <laughs> <laughs> Fell from the sky. All right. Oh, Paul Hughes <laughs> just fought uh, tonight. Oh, did he? Yeah, he run. Oh, he won he round one elbows. Oh, nice. See what I mean? That's See, Fabiano he's Silva. sick. I like him. Yeah. All right, yeah, so Sherry, yeah, before he steps into the octagon, he's in a prep point at the moment. Not Sherry, yeah, sorry, I'm actually going to be talking about the blue corner. So this is Mariscal. Mariscal. Some expectations. I do think he's got to take the fight to Sherry, yeah, like he did against Trevor Peak, make it really messy and just look for Sherry yeah, to, in the kind of brawl-like scenarios, if you like. But 
if he doesn't give Sherry the time to set up his strikes, then Mariscal could probably cause an upset. I reckon he can catch him in a mm. very nasty way. I do think he does need to get this in, in real close, rough <laughs> Sherry up in the clinches, uh, and just secure that takedown because he might fancy his chances on the ground a little bit more. Um, being a bit overly physical if he can. Sherry has a tendency mm. of playing it safe, which results in low pace fight. Perfect for Mariscal to take control and dedicate the rules of engagement, paying Sherry back yeah. for every strike that he's landed. Yeah, and as I don't know who looked for oh, sorry. Sherry Air then, I think he needs to work off of his sniper, uh, that, that sniper jab of his to stifle uh, Mariscal from coming forward and set up the right cross. Uh, so he can set up the right cross, sorry. The, the way he finished um, uh, Zuccini in his debut was sensational. He got um, him thinking about the jab and then finished the, the fight with the body kicks. Um, we've got to see those kicks again. He's got to keep it technical against the brawler. Command the center of the octagon, draw out the power shots of Mariscal while touching him with that outside calf kick. The goal would be to um, just kind of siphon the power out of uh, Mariscal's punches and um, uh, by compromising that lead leg first. Yeah. Here we go. Moments away. Mo Keep it. Who did we in. pick in this one, lads? Apparently, according to. Yeah, I got Sherry. Yeah, I, I think it might be second round finish. Yeah, same. Um, Aaron says apparently Morgan's from a place Stand in by. France called Poissy. I never knew that. <laughs> Sir, are you ready? Oh, Sean's running the away. last Poissy pirate. <laughs> Oh, oh, Lord, what right, kicks. Powerful. Oh, oh no. Early Not here. a slow start for Sharia this time, eh? Oh, Mariscal gets the single leg. Oh, he's got, oh he's got a good Hello. Team, but Mariscal is... He's going to use it to get back to his feet, though. Finish him. Is Sharia. Oh, is this in? No. Oh. Some ground control at the moment. Right, now get up now. Yeah, no. Is he going to try a cinch in a dance? He's not going to get in for now, mate. Just no, get up. he needs to adjust his hands. Where did you go for, Ash? Get up. Uh, second round KO. For Sharia. He is. Oui, 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 oui. Oui, 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 oui. Il a du round KO. Monge de Paris. Monge de Paris. Poissy. You've hung out in his position too long now. You deserve getting taken down. Ash has spoken. And so it shall Sat be. Sat there for too long when he could have just exploded and got back to your feet. And now look, mm. now you're up against the cage. Good one. Mm. Ooh, Oof. knees to the inner thigh there. From if you had a pirate game. name, Ash, what would it be? Pirate name? Yeah, if you had a pirate name. So this guy's the last pirate, but if you had a pirate name, because that's not a pirate name, is no. it? You can't call yourself the last pirate. But... I don't know. Can I go you got Captain Blackbeard, you got... How many pirates do you know them? Um, that's a good point, actually. There you go. It'd be nice to know a pirate, You might it? be the last pirate. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. Yeah. Just saying. Yeah, to be fair, I've never seen him in the same room as any other pirate. No. Yeah. <laughs> so... <laughs> You know, him and another pirate room at the same to time. Taken down. He deserves one. to get taken down because of... There we go. Nice. So oh, well done. And he's right. free. Nice to free it. Back to the feet here. Ooh, good jab. Good jab. As Mariscal went for the low kick there. Mariscal fainting the the kicks. Is there something unique about his shorts? Do they all have that blue Ooh. name on it? Uh, I feel like it's matching his hair no, colour. because he's... Uh, yeah. It seems quite... Unique in a way, doesn't it? Mm. I wonder. Actually, yeah, that's not right. I don't think they all have. He's not in the Actually, blue corner, no, no. is he? Yeah, no, uh, no, they don't do that for shorts. But I mean, the white shorts have the red name. I know, but I didn't think they normally did that. I just thought it was part of the design. Hmm. If you got white shorts, it'd be red letters. Black shorts, perhaps blue. Yeah, it might be colour for it. Oh, I wonder if I thought it'd do. Hmm. So He's relentless with his takedown attempts, isn't he? 
Yeah, Maris yeah, Kilmos really wants to work in. Working fighting them elbows. You'd think he wants oh, it. On. Oh, yeah. Let's do it again. Plant it. Another one. Fighting them elbows. Another oh. one. Aaron saying the first pirate. I guess you could have a nickname as the first pirate if you really want to. Oh, yeah. But, you know, what are we starting here exactly? Mm. What are we starting here? I want to be the second from last part. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, this is hello. Relentless. Welcome on in, wow. El Capitano. Maris, Maris yes, Raphael. Raphael. Welcome on in. El Captain. I heard, rumor has it he's got a sh sailing vessel. Yeah, he's the captain. El Capitan. I mean? Yeah. Are you also the last pirate? Yeah. El Capitan. He's not the pirate, mate. He's the captain. Yeah, yeah. he got. Oh, did he drop him with that? Ow! Oh, no, I don't know. Wow. Mariscal looking a bit of a menace here in the first round. One this minute left. This is ridiculous ugly. pace as well. Such man. a wild pace. It's frustrating. I've not me. seen Charrier with this much pace before. <laughs> We, 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 we. I've got the, I've got the, I've got the uh, going on with the name. Yeah, there, I, I want that. I want that. Good, <laughs> I want that. <laughs> oh, we, 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 with the takedowns. Oh, oh. Wow, yeah, with the takedown that time. Oh, monge we, two, senor. Monge two. Monge two. Nah, monge two. Oh, head kick. We, oui, monsieur. Head kick attempt. Push. Cut inside from Sharia. He keeps ducking his head. Throw a knee. Yeah, near, yeah, got to, near. Got to throw some knees in there, close. Oh, what a body kick! Yeah, nice. Mariscal Ready wearing here. some damage here. Cyclops saying too much holding against the cage. Oh, Referee needs to intervene nice. more. Speed for Mariscal. Today, Sub Zero has good defense. Well, I think it's just Beyblade in. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> damage though. Look at Mariscal's face. Yeah. He Shall looks he, like he's we, been we, brocked we, up. We, we, we. Uh, yeah, who's who's giving that round to Charrier then? That's tough. Although, that if we look tough. at that damage, yeah. Mariscal's really wearing it. Oh, look at that eye. Both of them. It's like he's been scratched on them, to be honest. Both very sloppy in holds, so shall go. <laughs> yeah, WrestleMania up on the side screen. <laughs> Just something. You've it. literally been, uh, you're not been well excited for WrestleMania, haven't you? I have actually. Is that I, have. I don't know why. That, that promo today like. was the only one that kind of got me going, hmm, that actually looks all right. But before that, I thought it was all cheesy. Are you going to be watching it with Luke then later on? Yeah, me, <laughs> me, me and him, yeah. Doing your own uh, watch along for WrestleMania. <laughs> yeah, it's a good idea, yeah. With uh, TV screens on. But just remember, so I've ruled, I remember. As soon as we wrap up here, Ash is going, okay, bye. Yeah. <laughs> it's straight over yeah. there. <laughs> You put your. Uh, it's real, though, Sai. You... What? Say again? I said, remember, it's real, Sai. Oh, it's real. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. not that conversation again. <laughs> Go that time. Bro. Are you, you going to be putting your TV on the ceiling uh, then, Ash? Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, inside joke, inside joke. That's, that's, that's what, when he was doing his wedding vows, the, the person was like, who are you looking at? You're meant to be looking <laughs> yeah, at the wife. Yeah, yeah. Like, Oh, stop it. It's so oh, unless that was probably where his vows were written. Oh, <laughs> uh, give Wales some love. Here we go, round two. What good Wales, what good. In the hood. How did you guys score that first round in the chat? So let's have it. It's here. Did you say yeah. that was the first round to Mariscal? Or do you think Charrier did what Charrier. needed to be done? Right, come on. <laughs> Three points this round. Ash, you're breaking up. Three points. <laughs> Ash, you're breaking yeah, how much up. Phlegm do you We're want losing you, mate. In that sherry air. <laughs> oh, good straight Way. by. Nice. Sucker Paul saying Mariscal looking sloth after round two, after round one. Mm. <laughs> Dangerous still, though. Mm. Dangerous <laughs> still. Oh. Shango V said that Ash has a has his WrestleMania pick league going on. Yeah. Traitor. <laughs> <laughs> He's top of his own. <laughs> You're the top of that one. You're winning that. Oh, oh get... just missed with the overhand right at that time. I need a free pointer, man. I'm desperate. Oh, Ash, went high Ash, that time. The Ash kick. is the top of the league because he's got the script for the uh, yeah for, for the for You're the fight. Going fights. for the rock. Yeah, You're exactly. Going for Roman Reigns. Is Logan Paul going to be there? I think he's fighting. Yeah, fighting. Oh, fuck. yeah. <laughs> you wouldn't call it fighting, mate. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Is he, is he wrestling tonight? Yeah. What a cool he's fight, fake wrestling. <laughs> he's pillow fighting tonight. Yeah, he's playing. <laughs> yeah, it's like a pool player. Yeah, he's playing. Body shot. 
Play him, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Fight him. What all about? Yeah, he's performing. Ooh, he's performing. Shots, man. Yes, well said, yeah. yeah. Like a like a drag queen on set. Ooh, toe to the head. Oh, oh. Mariscal went high. Not gonna lie, Mariscal is slowly swindling the pendulum for me. You reckon? Yeah. Oh, over oh, swang. Oh. oh. Shario needs to get this done if he wants to be on. No, Wales. Harris is not number one, man. This fight league is hotting up at the top. Sean and May's Ooh, taking it. They're going at it now, Shario really going to have to get his win if he wants to get on that UK oh. card. Ilo. Yeah, he does. He really does, doesn't well, he? Why does he want to be on it? Did he just well, he's it? from France, isn't he? So he's, yeah, it's I think they're going be close back to Paris to in September, though. Oh, would he? Mm. He is just slap him, yeah. The disrespect. Disrespect. Nice. Oh, I love that uppercut. As well. Hello? Yeah, but yeah, I mean, again, look at the damage, right? I think Mariscal's thrown some beautiful blinding punches, but Charrier is not wearing anything. Mm. Oof. Oh, great body shot. He's hurt. He lowered his arm. Who's this? Oh, yeah. yeah so how good. Are you? So good. Sachi Bleu! Pour putain de putain. So good, man. Love it. Charlie Air is a beast, though. He's taken strikes which should be even marks on his face, but man's made a deal with Davy Jones. <laughs> oh, nice. Nice footwork, man. Oh! oh Charlie nice. Air looking to send Mariscal to the locker. He <laughs> 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 missed that kick. He always set himself. <laughs> um, Mariscal's got a bit of a chin Dude. now because uh, Charlie is tagging him. He is, but also I'd say Charlie has got a bit of a chin too because he's not wearing any of those strikes. Whoa! Whoa. Him with that kick. Yeah, yeah that kick. Oh, slap him, did, did he? Morgan looks good. One kick from Charrier and Mariscal was like trying to learn how to walk again. Oh, faut gaucher en ce soir! I don't know what I'm doing now. Avec what? Voulez-vous caucher avec... Voulez-vous caucher avec moi? Fuck it. How did you know that? Yeah. Lady Marmalade. Lady <laughs> Marmalade. That's how... Oh, and oh, another if you ever go to, If you ever go to France, Ow. scrambles are great. Ooh, Whoa. Shot, shot, if you ever go to France, that's how you girl. say um, tea and can I have one coffee? Um, oh! Oh! Slap that him. front kick to the face Look was mad. Nice. Oh damn! What an was that way just to two? End the round. That was only two. Oh wow! How did we score that one? That was wild. Uh, there's got to be Shadi around, surely. This was a potential fight of night oh. for me. And it's it's one one, I think. Yeah, uh, Shane and Shah needs to pick up the pace here. <laughs> Well, are saying Shango looking better than it was in the prelims, mate. So we're giving props to him for his pick so far on the main card. Picking up. Yeah, to Sh I said to Shango earlier, I said, this is where I drop. And now look. Drop it like I'm it's hot. Well, says, what's the best part about going to France? Um, Voulez-vous cachet <laughs> yeah, the trip home? <laughs> <laughs> Love that. Is that what it is? Ooh, that's good. <laughs> was asking me because I was there, but as voulez-vous cacher avec moi? Oh, yeah. well. <laughs> <laughs> the Welsh shag sheep, the French fro shag frogs. <laughs> Shango Visa Shark, slow to capitalize on his hat, on his lands, and eats counters whilst slow in deciding what to do. Slow in what to do. Wales, you might know this as well. Oof. French fries, not actually from France, are they? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why? Why, but why called, do Americans call them French fries? It makes no sense. They call them French fries, not even from France. Being in the land of the uh, 
Americanos. Uh, well, perhaps you could enlighten us why the Americans do that. Well, says JK, a frog with a glass ass only leaps once, mate. Yeah. True that. True that. I'm going to remember that and tell my child on the wedding day. Freedom fries, <laughs> sigh. Freedom fries. Is that what they call them now? Don't call it French fries. It's freedom fries. I'm sorry. Politically incorrect. My bad. Freedom my fries. bad. My bad. Freedom fries. <laughs> From the land of the free. <laughs> Ooh, Good pace here from Shahi. Oh my lord. Shahi, you pick it up. Oh, hello. Oh, Mariscal. Mariscal just pressing the next, Mate. finding a whole oh, new gear. Sure, yeah, needs to get out Whoa. of there. Bro. Oh, man. This has been a war. This I is thought so Shariel good. I kind of sit back and. Mariscal found another gear from wee, nowhere. Wee, wee. I that thought he was driving. Beautiful takedown, Aaron. Americans. Love culture and we'll embrace it without knowing what the F is. <laughs> yeah, just, that. just embrace it. One one friend, one American came over to Europe, um, had some fries in France. They were actually from Belgium. Said, oh, I'm going to call them French fries. They're Belgium. <laughs> Calling them Belgian fries is just not the same ring. Doesn't though, that ring, it? does it? God, well, this guy's throwing still from the bottom. I know. I mean... Is Mariscal winning this fight? I don't know. Yeah. Such is the level of the Cage Warriors division. That we being said, Vachenik. that being said, who did we have on the Cage Warriors cards recently? Two, two, uh, no one, two nil nil, no win girls on the Cage Warriors got signed. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Was that it? Two girls? Yeah. Two girls got signed on the Cage Warriors. And they hadn't even won a it's single fight. Annoying. But the commentator says... How many? What, what did you just say? Two girls got into the Cage Warriors. Well, one cup? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Cup. That's it, yeah. No, no, not even one cup. That's the thing. <laughs> Between two girls, <laughs> not one of them got a single cup. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can he hold it's this for two minutes, satanic so... worshippers in Hollywood. Ooh. That's what I said, satanic worshippers in Hollywood. They embrace him. Agreed, Aaron, Ooh. but needs to use it. Uh, culture. Oh, damn, it. sure is. I don't know where it's from. Oh, is it that bad over there? Up the back nearly. Oof. I wonder what cultures that is from him. Mm. Oof. Oof. Ooh, is that the, is that a kind of thing where they take the placenta as well? Ooh, I've heard about that. I've heard some people sell Dance their baby's now. placenta. Oh, hello. Probably. And you try to have a placenta. Eat babies. Placentas, yeah. Apparently, right, gives, now don't sit here for too long. Just get back to your feet. You're gonna lose the position. Don't sit here for too long. He's gonna lean into you. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq. <laughs> get out of here. <laughs> God, dear. <laughs> what did I just say? What did I just say? Voulez-vous coucher avec moi? C'est ça. Ah. Oh, no, 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 L oh, oh, I'm so Mascal's terrible gonna at this, French. Mascal's going to take this. But this was, this was it. I wish Jean I was better bonjour. at it. Je m'appelle Ali. J'habite Staines. This is tough as well. It's giving this fight to Charrier, but now... What is this? What are we getting tangled in a knot? How are we scoring this fight? Getting knotted. Don't even know who's on top here. Wow, Mariscal is just... Aaron says, could be 29 either way, fight of the night for sure. Bad. Yeah, for me. Uh, Wales says, we had a 4.8 earthquake in Jersey yesterday. Never felt the ground shake <laughs> like that. Monday, we we're having the this eclipse. At the same time, CERN is firing. Shit up. So, Saturn? Is that Saturn, maybe? So, I don't know. Something like that. 
Wait, is it the uh, end of the world over there, yeah, Wales? Yeah. <laughs> is it the end of the world over there? Really? Ross. Mm, Never had an earthquake. I want to check that out. Seriously? Serious. 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 Wild, that. Uh, Shango saying, if this lasts, I may marry. Takes this in decision. Did you think one that one, boys? Why is this not? Like, I actually don't know. I'm hoping that um, Morgan's won it by decision. Well, at least I'll get another point. We're not getting any methods right tonight. I've had a few decisions. No. I've, I've li probably had like one decision or two decisions. Yeah. Oh, actually, I did say decision on that one. Um, but didn't think it was going to happen. Don't even know if things going to go to Sharia, so we shall see. Mm. I think I originally put decision, but I might have changed it. I yeah, mean, I mean, it would make sense for this fight. I, 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 I regret the decision, decision earlier. Um, He's just got one bad eye. Decision. Mm, and bad hair. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and that. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't know there's a spider in his head. Why would you have that kind of hair in the octagon? I the weekend know. did Somewhere. it for us. Yeah. It was the weekend, <laughs> wasn't it? Weekend. It was all that. Just blame the weekend's his fault. Absolute fool. Here we go. Decision coming up. Smash like on the video if you've not done so already, guys. Why is this always falling apart? I can't dig the hairstyle, to be fair, but oh, yeah, it's, it's not practical. Split decision. Oh, split Maris decision. Wow, split decision Sherry, yeah, can go anywhere. 30, oh, mixed oh. judges. Oh, oh. what? Oh. oh, Chappé takes the decision. You no. detest. You detest. Ah. Ah. Paris getting I'm, some points there. I'm sticking WrestleMania on, lads. I see that. Oh, man. Need to did that. more for judges, I think. Shashango. He's a natural blue, guys. 30 27. Morgan is crazy. But Close fight. To be fair, no, either uh, way. Yeah, it really could have gone. I I'm, don't mind having this shocking, shocking performance and then Damon Jackson and Chris Kurtz go win. I'll take it. Yeah. Oh, but to tell you the truth as well with that, um, impressed with the performance of Mariscal. Can't lie. Yeah. Yeah, he no, he was scrappy, impressive. Yeah. He found another gear when I didn't think he had anything left. Wales got one right. Well played, Wales. Shooting up into the leaderboard now. Ooh. Guy wants to get back in there quick and. Goodness sake. Bra. Bra. You detest. Have a buzz cut as well, this guy. Aaron and Edward J. MMA in at 13 points at the top thus far. Um, and there it be. Did you good. guys at home guess that would be how that fight was going to turn out? I did <laughs> not. But when they said split decision, and then they gave one, and when they read out the, red, the, the judges scorecard to uh, so, Shakia, um, Mariscal was like, what? What do you think split decision means? Do you, um, do you think, um, obviously, they got rid of the Cynthia Corveo uh, fight, yeah. uh, but was that due to her saying that she didn't want to fight because her opponent was, because uh, her opponent saying that because Cynthia was overweight, maybe? Or, because obviously, Hernandez missed weight as well, didn't he? And it's a catchway, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Maybe, maybe. Could be. Uh didn't really look too into it if I'm honest. New hairline, Damon Jackson is a mythical <laughs> beast, mate. Oh mate. But we shall see if he comes out on top after this one. It's all in the confidence. It's, it's, you know what I mean? Been on the against the fence. It's, look. See, see that? Yeah. Uh, what what a stat. It's uh, I was gonna say it's uh, it's all in the confidence at the end of the day, and look at this man. Overflowing with it. He's a handsome chap now, isn't he? Bro, took that glow up. That glow up. Uh, Shango yeah, V man. saying, to be honest, I agree with that. No points for me there. Psycho Paul saying, judges got that wrong. You should dead test. You should test. Here comes another UFC 300 promo. Sit back, lads. Sit back and enjoy it. Oh, yeah. Surely it's not going to take too long, though, because this went to a decision. 
So, you get me. Go, main. Alex Hernandez. Damon Jackson. Who's everyone picking? That's the thingy. Oh, where well, it says, Yo, Ash, I told you about the bacon, egg, and cheese. My boy yeah. at work introduced me to the Taylor ham, bacon, egg, and cheese, salt, Ooh. pepper, ketchup. Game changer, Ash, mate. Oh. There you go. Mm. Taylor ham, bacon, egg, and cheese. With salt, pepper, and ketchup. Talking food here. Well, yeah, we definitely know you're blooming stronger and bigger, mate. Like, that's not obvious. Is that what mate boy's saying? Um, Shango saying, Ash, the two of us are versus Tybora Knight. I had a mare. Also, the Hummansen one. Uh, so, chin up, <laughs> mate. I'm treading water a bit at the moment in tonight, he says. So, so far... Leaderboard tonight. Oh, Dylan's SG has made a bit of a rise. We've got a three-way tie between Edward J MMA, him and Aaron. Sean MMA nine, who's now top of the overall leaderboard, is in at number two. Leslie, Taylor, and Powell in at three. Marco, your boy Phils, Steve P, Breezy in at number four. Darren, Justin, MMA Militants, five. Wales in at six with myself. Oh, no, mm. no, no. With Harris. Anyway, uh, should we get into this one or wait for Si? Uh, we'll, uh, you can get in now. It's fine. He's on his way back. Yeah, let's jump into our boy, Jeremy, uh, Damon Jackson, then, who's got a pro record of 12 wins with six, uh, 22 wins with six losses, with four KOs and 15 submissions and nine first-round finishes. He does have a UFC record of five wins and four losses, and he made his UFC debut in 2014. But he has lost his last two fights. Hmm. Yeah. I'll tell you what he hasn't lost. His hairline. Well, hey. <laughs> he reeled that back in. He reeled that back in. <laughs> he he certainly he did. did. Okay. Now he's North Locks fighter, purple belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. Wrestling was his first discipline. He keeps his guard quite tight betted his head forwards to kind of draw out the strikes of his opponents and then he kind of punishes them for it, whips it right back. Now, he makes good use of the mo of the front kick up the middle. He caught Sabatini with it as well in his last fight. That would look quite good. But he's yeah, got his ex... Back, yeah, oh, feedbacks, yeah. But he's got his excellent control on the ground. Like, he likes to stay busy when in the guard and just seek that right opportunity to work out the submission as well. Love that and jumping on to his opponent Alex Hernandez and who's got a pro record of 14 wins with seven losses with six KOs and two submissions and seven first round finishes uh, and his UFC record is six wins and six losses and he made his UFC debut in 2018 and he has only won one of his last four oh that's that right Jim Miller. tough times it's, it's, it's a good Good point there. Uh, he's an orthodox fighter with black belt in jiu-jitsu. He's fast and explosive. Faints his hips and kicks to set up traps and expose the target for his hands. Keeps the pressure applied with his lead jab. Leans in heavy on his lead leg with a low center of gravity. Ready to defend takedowns or shoot uh, grappling offenses of his own. He's certainly the busiest striker with great combinations and output on the feet. Yes. Uh, Whale well saying he's gone on Hernandez by decision in this. Who's the uh, resident jinx at the moment? Uh, Is it Shango V still? Maybe. Shango, who did you pick? Hernandez. Mm, right, I see. don't want Hernandez. You got Hernandez <laughs> round one knockout. I can so see it. Oh, I did do Hernandez. Ooh. Did you, did you go Hernandez as well, JK? Uh, I think I might have went Hernandez round one. The decision. Uh, I'm not discounting handsome Damon Jackson. That, that, yeah, I went round one knockout. I do feel like handsome Jackson will probably have a good yeah, durability. It's just a power advantage for Hernandez for me. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, know? I just think if if. But this is the thing as well. If, if Jackson can't get him down, yeah, is that the it's going to be a hard one for him. He's 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 got to it jump, is. jump on the back. 
Is he giving us blue still in that picture for the UFC right here? On the, on well, the... Harris actually went blue picture. What blue picture? Uh, blue, blue steel. You know uh, yeah. the old Zoolander. Yeah, he's giving us that, yeah, isn't he? In that one. Um, Harrison, I went Jackson decision. Ooh. Resident Jinx. Uh, yeah, look so at that. Judging, Definitely blue steel. Judging <laughs> by my hit and miss picking, he's in trouble. So, yeah, maybe Damon Jackson's likely going to get the, the win here, judging by everyone's picks. Yeah, it looks like it. Let's get some expectations. I wonder if you could do something about the shoulder blades. Sharp, aren't they? Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, you should, and that tattoo. you should just shoulder barge. Expectations. The pace he opened out with his, his fight against Colin Tillo was wild. Yes. Um, Billy Q, that was a really good fight. Like, it wasn't the best against Billy's cardio, but I do think he could have had some, it could have some effect on Hernandez if he was able to stay defensively responsible and just put together really awkward striking patterns like he exhibited to us with Billy Q. Now, He's got to level change on Hernandez if he's able to get to if he's able to back him up towards the cage. Making Hernandez just fight off out of those positions will probably benefit him as the fight draws long. Hernandez is difficult to submit, granted, yes, but Jackson does need to put him in those compromising positions, even if he's just unable to sink in the sub. It'll just wear in his gas tank and make him a bit more advantageous yeah. if the fight goes yeah. long. Yeah. <laughs> Just need to jump on him like Maracana did. Right. Yeah, basically, yeah. Jump Jackson, back. yeah, yeah. Jackson does need to better manage his tank in this one, I think. He would actually look to look great when the when it's full, but if he loses so much composure and power when when it's empty. So ideally, he needs to manage it throughout the distance and yeah. uh, not give up so quickly. Just going to get that timer real quick. Yeah, you get the timer real quick. Ooh, didn't go for the touch glove. Ooh. Ooh. I'm guessing that's because he missed weight, though. Maybe. Yeah. Heading into the Algeo fight, uh, we were concerned for Hernandez's gas tank or his cardio because of the weight cut to 145. But it looked pretty good against the fast guy. He had uh, to chase the f for, for most of the fight. I'm still expecting Hernandez to remain measured but and not burn himself out in this one. Uh, and only resort to wrestling if... You know, he, he, if he's got plenty left in, in the tank, so maybe towards the third round. Um, he had a hard time dealing with the tall ranger, Bill Algio. Um, Jackson will have some height on Hernandez. However, I do expect him to fight long um, at all. I don't expect mm. him to fight long at all. Uh, I think that uh, Hernandez will, can, can work his way into pocket and kind of a lot better and, and land his power strikes. Mm. Yeah, uh, look at him now. The way he's like dodging in and out just to get in there. Very well, low second attempt on attempt two. Yeah, I think he needs to also need to target the body, Jackson, before landing and peeling off for angles. Mm. Mm. Oh. He's effective when he gets in there. He's, he doesn't hang around for long at all. Mm. Oof. That's it. Jackson needs to go for some kicks as well. Let's go for some high kicks. Just prevent Hernandez uh, from entering pocket, really. Mm. Just talking about knocking your boy out, um, Vinil Darius. So. Who's oh, doing yeah, that? Hernandez, yeah. He did. Here we go. He did. Here we go. Oh, Here we go. That was another life. Drive, 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 drive. Now we're against the cage. Come on now. I know I picked Hernandez to win, but I'm dragon. fully supporting Jackson. Yeah. That hairline has won me over entirely. I think I might fancy him a bit. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't get like the tattoo. No, no, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. It's almost like he's trying to go for like <laughs> classic Wolverine Origins Wade Wilson. Mm, he yeah, just needs to get the rest of it. <laughs> I still don't get the rest of it. And, and, the and just like you know, stay from his mouth. At least make shut. these, um, yeah. at least make these knees a bit effective. You know what I mean. I see what you mean now when you said about the tattoo, so you get some work done yeah. on the tattoo as well. If you could turn that into something, what would you turn it into? <laughs> you kind of got to just make it a massive twin towers, uh, massive knots and crosses on your back. <laughs> yeah, just turn it to a road. A road. Basically. I don't like when um, when uh, Jackson's pinned up against the cage. No, I see, I, I see Ilya vibes. Yeah. Mm. I don't like it when a tattoo is just like leading into the trousers. It's almost like drawing your eye line down. You've definitely said that before. Yeah, I have. I have. It's, it's this tattoo. 
Uh, You're going to get any tattoos, so... Probably not. If I did, it would be like a breastplate arm thing, but I'm not too fast. Arm. Yeah. Kind of like the idea of like a, a Roman... Just get a baby sucking your tit. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's good knees. You know I like yeah. these knees. These knees are effective. These are better knees. Effective. Look mm -hmm. at these. Granddad in him. He doesn't like it. Of course guess they he are. Like it, does he? All right, I'll tell you what then. Next week, mate, I'll pin you up against the wall and I'll granddad you ten times. Yeah. <laughs> it's quite That'll close to the balls. To they're, they're not doing anything. Uh, Shango saying Jackson, some nasty leg kicks, keeping distance. Hernandez needs to close in and avoid grappling. Uh, Look, these knees are like surely strange. discouraging. I guess these will go towards strike numbers, right? Mm -hmm. That's an easy 20 there. Come on, Jackson. Ooh. I'm just trying to learn some. Jackson does go to work. Well, says so si, you should get the Mike Tyson tattoo. Hey. What happens in Bangkok nice, stays Jackson, in Bangkok. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Nice. What well, happens in blank Bangkok stays in Bangkok. I can't even do the Mike Tyson accent. The lift. The lift. <laughs> I'm Mike Tyson, man. You want to fight me, Puff? You, you want to fight me, Puff? <laughs> hey, we all it's actually do... not bad for for you, so si. It's not we bad. We all do effed up <laughs> shit. Just chuck a lift on it. Up, you know what I'm how cruel would it be to have a lisp and a name like Silas? You know what I mean? <laughs> How cruel. You just don't ever say your name. <laughs> you say, what's your name? <laughs> You're Phylus. Your name's Phylus. <laughs> you got no pies. Is that it? <laughs> yeah, I mean, Writes Jackson, down, Jackson's round. spells it T H I S. Oh, wait. This? <laughs> Phylus. <laughs> You know what I mean? T -H -I -L -S. Just, and at what point? At what point are you like, I'm changing my name? I'm, I can't do this. I can't do this. <laughs> <laughs> it's cruel. Oh joking. man, school would be rough. Oh, mate. <laughs> Imagine. Ooh. You know how it's like dys well, dyslexia is a very difficult word to spell for someone who's dyslexic. Mm. <laughs> so how, it's like the, how so I enjoying the irony. non eye poke fight night so far says Shango how am I enjoying it uh, oh yeah you missed you missed the events of last week didn't you oh yeah uh, JK, yeah, of course you a about. million eye pokes weren't there there was a lot of my pokes I mean there's probably yeah, Chris due Weidman's for... a dirty man yeah, uh, yeah. I think he's, he's, his point's pretty fair yeah see Jordan, nah, disagree, <laughs> Jordan loves it too <laughs> disagree but then if you're bruno why did you go down like that yeah he was he was he was dropping a little bit too easily I agreed with that point but like the thing for me is like I, in my you don't go I'm like new, you don't man. go down like that in in hindsight trusting chris didn't poke that in the eye as well um <laughs> it, it was it was uh if it didn't go as a this it did go down in the end as scorecards didn't it yeah, and yeah, therefore, yeah. people think that Bruno was. It would have had the same outcome. And was looking for a no contest. That's what I've heard. Yeah, it sounded yeah, but it oh, wouldn't have Hernandez worked for mine. Got bleeding, was he? Oh, Jackson utilizing the teeps early in the second round. Uh, Come on, Jackson. Ooh. So far, we're not seeing. Some big power strikes from Hernandez, yet. Yeah. yeah, seeing a bit of fatigue from Jackson, though. Okay. Hernandez will fade. I've seen Jackson fade a bit, though. I think Jackson needs to get him against the cage and just use those shoulder strikes. Conor McGregor-esque. Shoulder yeah, strikes. Yeah, 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 weaponize yeah, weaponize those. Exactly. Uh... Why use elbows? Why get him down and use elbows? Just drop the shoulder, man. Like... Do you know what? <laughs> I wouldn't mind to that, see that, them weaponize them as well. It'd probably make it be illegal eventually, but wait, they're daggers. They are. Oh. It's sharp, isn't it? You're right. He sharpens them, mate. Yeah. Maybe next time we get him on the channel, we'll ask him about shoulder strikes. Yeah. Have <laughs> you thought about we'll ask him opening tin cans of those things? Do you want a beer, mate? Oh, good left hand. <laughs> oh, Hello. yeah. Nice short left hand from Jackson. Damn, Jackson's, Jackson's not looking too bad. Going 
Peyton Speed Kyle's now from Jackson. Jackson. It's impressive. Mm. Big swing and a miss there, though. I'd like to see a knee. So Jackson was quite good in his last fight about throwing a punch and following straight up with a kick as well. He had some good combinations. I like to. I haven't really seen much of that. Like a, a, a kick strike combo. Yeah, throw that kick and then follow straight up behind with a, with a, with some hands. I thought that striking was going to be a problem. It's doing all right so far, but hmm. I get this through the maybe I've been. Actual PC to roll out that high pitch. Good job. I want to take that, please. Yeah. Low kick from Hernandez there. Morning, morning, morning. Nice. So swap that to the rich man's work. No. Uh, Can I hear you, Ash? Hello? Oh, yeah, yeah, gotcha. What's happened? No, nah. Swapping. Headphone output. Yeah. It's a bit quieter, isn't it? It is a bit. I don't think you can up it, can you? Mm. Ooh, good left from J uh, Hernandez. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice kick there. How much did Jackson spend on that hair transplant as well? Five Gs, wasn't it? Five K? Poof, do you reckon? I think it was. At least. <laughs> Shane says Wales well, more than his back tattoo, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait. Still don't understand it. Go on, Jackson, get this takedown. Come on. Do you reckon if you're I mean after after that, after you just had your hair done, and you're only scrapping Scenarios and someone roughs your hair up, you get a little bit pissed off, wouldn't you? I'd be a bit yeah, annoyed by that. Touch my hair, get a bit precious. I mean, I've seen footballers, you know, dive when someone touches their hair. Yeah, you've got people here in the UFC, someone brushes over that nice new little piece of shove that shoulder blade into his belly and dig it in. None at all. I can hear him Go quiet. Is that nothing? Nothing. Keep talking, Ash. Say something, Ash. Hello, hello, hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, no, okay. Yeah, I just got you quiet, but... Oh, take it back. Go on, Jackson. Give me a second round sub. Come on. Oh, did you do oh. sub, Dash? Yeah, second round sub. Come on. No Imagine. way. It's 33 seconds nah. to get it done. Come on, Jackson. It's difficult, this. So far, we've got... Oh, uh, oh, Hernandez fighting hands well. Oh. He's got one arm underneath the chin. He's got to get that other hand free, though. If I'm Hernandez, I'm clamping down with my arm here. Yeah, I'm not letting that out. I'm not letting that Jackson out. Jackson needs to get fr free, but he's running out of time. Let him work. Nice. Let him work. Good round for Jackson, man. Yeah, it's it really is. 2-0 two, two, two up, man. Do you reckon so? Two two yeah. Nice. Yeah, good, All day. good showing. All day, 2-0 up. Damon. And you know what? As it goes long, I've got less faith in Hernandez. Yeah. I thought you were trying to do your lisp then. <laughs> it goes longer. I have it goes longer. I have faith. It goes longer. I can have faith in Hernandez. Good faith. <laughs> nice to meet you, my name's Father. I think I'm going to get up uh, some Mike Tyson memes. The worst name to have. <laughs> Um, what? <laughs> How did? Uh, oh, I was gonna just put Mike Tyson in. He's got a good head of hair, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> he's, a, he's a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the hair! Oh, mate. Definitely. Should have put like the hair on the line. Whoever loses has to shave the head. That would have made. Oh, oh no, this dropped him straight right. Oh wow! Speed He's still got hair. some Blood energy is in, the tank. in the water. He's oh. teeing off on Jackson on the ground. Jackson's still fighting, but Hernandez is now on the back. Oh. He's only one hook in though. I was literally just about to ask. He's adjusting. You boys, where was your? 
where would your mindset be at? You're two rounds up. Like, you know what I mean? What's your mindset at? And then boom, he just drops yeah, it. Yeah, oh. it's got to be that. Although I, can't, I don't know why he would have done. I can't for the life of me understand why I put Hernandez's decision, to be honest. But I did. Oh, man. Full oh. mount here. He's trying to tie up the arm, I think. Yep, survival mode for Jackson. Handsome Jackson. Where else is uh, Ash, JK? We got a chance tomorrow versus the Scousers. Oh, so here's Ooh. the fatigue Jackson now showing... Showing I think holes. Tied, to be fair, yeah, man. very much so. But Jackson tends to show a lot more holes in his... Exploding here. Co yeah, co like lack of composure. Holes in his guard. When fatigued. Very nonchalant. Oh, that was absolutely filthy. Oh, oh hello, Jackson. Nice. Oh, that was naughty. Whoa. Nicely done, Damon. I'll take the two points, though. Get me a sub this round, though, brother. Uh, <laughs> Ninja'd his way around there like that. Oh, he's got him flattened out. Go on, Jackson. Bro. No, oh, yes. Well, Jackson. Oh, yeah, but his hands out. are stuck. Yeah, I don't think he's going to get... Oh, he's got he's him out. Beat him. beat him up. Wow. Wow, the strength of Props Fernandez. Look, Look at those Jackson legs. Fighting out. Fighting grab the back. leg, grab the leg, you're too high. Grab the leg, grab the leg. Twerk it, twerk it, twerk it. He's trying to shake him off here. Voulez-vous coucher avec moi ce soir? Shake that guy to the ground. Get on top, out the back door. Out the back door. Put him off like a jumper. Put him off like a hoodie. <laughs> to work. Wow, he's just... Time to go to work. Ah, didn't it? Just like shake, yeah, shake, 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 shake. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it's going to work here. <laughs> In the third. Yeah, I think it could be 1-1. One, one. You reckon? Yeah. Uh, mm, I mean... Where, where's your stats up? Where's the strikes for round one? Because Damon Jackson had control. Yeah. Mm. I want to see the striking numbers round Oops, one. This I don't have. I don't know if you can, Jake, on yours. The UFC site. It's going to want to be close. <laughs> this is Hernandez's round for sure. Who's yeah, looking right, up the most for the whole fight in general? I've tired, man. Wow. Uh, Blue corner's up. You want just round one? Yeah, just round one. Who who was up in strikes? Yeah, uh, Damien Jackson had the total of thirty strikes to Hernandez's eleven. Uh, yeah, those, round it's those, it's those, those knees. It's those knees. It was just landing but, over and over, wasn't it? According to this, significant strikes wise, Hernandez landed eleven. Damien landed ten. Hmm. Yeah, it was those knees that really kind of got the strike number up for. Yeah, mm. no, I, I, I think <coughs> it's uh, it's going to be two one. Jackson surely. Unless, obviously, he, uh, Hernandez lands a bomb again. Yeah. I think Jackson needs to do something with it. The ref just warned him to do something. Yeah. You, need, you, you can't go to the center of your octagon again, Jackson. You need to do something here. Yeah, he's, 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 that's got to work. He wants to hold on till the end. And if he does, I reckon it's a Jackson fight. But hopefully the, ref, the referees can see who's doing the damage and who's doing the holding. We need punctuation from uh, Hernandez. Yeah. <laughs> so if you're looking at this particular round three, whilst the duration is Jackson, he's dominating for the longer time, damage was Hernandez because he dropped him, right? Oh, yeah. I think I think Hernandez is winning this round, but I wouldn't want to be a judge, though. No, I wouldn't. I could see an argument as to why Hernandez still wins this. Oh, I, wish, I wish they broke him off. I wish Oof. Herzog broke him up. Oh, punches and bunches Ooh, to finish yeah, the round. Good indeed. Strikes. There we go. Great fight. <coughs> good back and forth contest, but which way will the decision go? If Jackson loses this, I am literally going off. It could. <laughs> it, but honestly, yeah. rounds one and two were Jackson's all day. All day. Yeah. I can yeah. see an argument for that. How did Mike Tyson feel when the God of Thunder smacked him on the thumb with his hammer? Yes. 
Thor. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 <Yes. laughs> That's a good one. Oh, Thor. That's Thor. good. <laughs> uh, Shango says this has been a fight night of ground and fence holds I think someone mentioned that earlier actually yeah <coughs> that's kind of uh, been that way fair few decisions where he hadn't done that. to be fair I think that last fight should have been a co-main if you think about it Mm. This fight wasn't really yeah, worthy of coming status, but you know, happy we run names. back. I think it's because Jackson Shekhe. used to be ranked. Shekhe, yeah. To be fair. Yeah, yeah. They've both been around the game for a bit. And then again, they did put Demont on the prelims, and she was ranked. Wales said I had Hernandez by decision, going by my dog picks tonight. Don't count on it. Oof. Well, I don't know. It looks like striking numbers round two now. Kind of. I did ask earlier who's the jinx tonight. Shango V said he went with Hernandez, and I did say, "Oh, I wish I'd have changed." Harris going decision. Jackson though. Ooh. Yeah, looking at nice significant look. strikes. Thirty twenty-seven Hernandez. Is someone on drugs or something? To be fair, significant strikes. Really? What do you mean? Uh, are you you're ahead of us, Ash? I think. Hey? I think you're ahead of us, isn't you? Who said thirty twenty-seven? Uh, Random. Yes, come on, Jackson. Let's go. Wait, you're wait, you're well ahead. Come on. Oh my days. Let's, Let's go. Catch up in a bit. Split. Let's go. Aris has got robbed. Thirty. Someone, some yeah. judge gave wow. all three rounds to Hernandez. You want drugs? Yeah, someone gave all. I don't know. Yeah, that's probably the same judge that uh, went um, three rounds to Chapier last time. Mug. It's wild. Try and catch up. Yeah, well done, Jackson. Well done, bro. Let's go. See what I mean? What did I say, boys? The 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 double of Jackson and, and uh, Curtis. Oh, did I actually do that double? Oh yeah. Uh, you went sub though as well. I did, but I'll take the point. Mm. Uh, I, no, I just mean in general because I I done it last week because I did a little because I put, put a post out last week saying like if any fighters want to win, do a double. Yeah. Yeah, I've, I've done a Jackson and C Chris Curtis double uh, for a pound. Wins wins me 11. That's all right. I mean, it's about... it's about That's more about pride than the money. <laughs> oh, he, he, yeah, Damon said uh, coming into this fight that uh, he didn't really like Hernandez. Dana? Damon. Let's go, Jackson. I was going to say Dana said don't that. Worry, I, I, don't worry, mate. Don't worry, mate. I won't say that the boy's better against you. Don't worry. Uh, oh, it's all coming out now. Oh, careful, mate. Don't I don't bet. ruffle the hair. Don't ruffle the hair. Yeah, don't ruffle the hair. You know, hands off the hair. Jamal Hill right there. Bro, look Yeah, we shape. see you. Yeah, we see you. Chiseled. Jay I'm going to go all in. I'm going to be bankrupt next week. Ooh. Aaron reckons it was 29-28. Man, that is... Welcome Boosh. on in, Canadian Bacon. Good stream, boys. Whee! Welcome on in, What's brother. Up, Smash that like button. T City. Night, night. Yeah. Night, night. Main event time. Boys, we are later than ever. Where else is train wreck tattoo, hair implants, and BS win another beer <laughs> bar man? I feel like the win was probably warranted, valid. To Aaron is absolutely fuming. Oh, yeah, your bet you had thinking by decision. You could have stole that. Oh, well. you nearly had $245,000. Not thousand, but pounds. Yeah, if you'd have put a pound on it, you'd have had two grand. Geesh. Yeah, that's, yeah come on, that's what you were That keeping, sucks, man. man. I'm Close. feeling for you. Close. Nothing for you, bro. Feel for you. That's what I was asking. Oh, Can you check you cash out? And then there's man. How, man, how badly? How badly did you want to be ringside with a spanner just to throw in there at, at um, Jackson's head to ensure the win for Hernandez? I just wonder what lengths we would have gone through there. for that. That's mad thing. Mad thing. Hmm. Would have just tucked a picture into the octagon of me holding Jackson's like <laughs> only hair subscription app to a flame. Only ranking we got as well. <laughs> if he won. Just to ensure that I get my 240, 45 pounds. 
Brendan Ireland looking to defend his sixth ranked spot in this against number 14 yeah. ranked Chris Curtis. Can Chris Curtis create an upset here? Um, he is the underdog coming into this fight, but he already has a win over Brendan Allen. Before. Here's a man with absolutely no problems with hair whatsoever. Yeah. <laughs> some say he, some say his beard goes as high as his eyebrows. And <laughs> he has to shave his cheekbones and, and uh, his uh, eye sacs to free it of beard hair. But yeah, you're right. This guy has done it before. Will he do it again? Is he an omen for for Adam? Alan's improving so much, though, man. Mm. He really has. You know, he's been coming along, finishing dudes, rear naked chokes. We, we do see that, easy. though. We do see that, though, don't we? We see fighters who just can't get past the middle block of someone yeah, who's put away We've got some interesting before. facts for Brandon Allen. It's like Allen PTSD well. almost, isn't it? We've got really good facts for yeah. Brandon Allen. Do you want to get on to oh, it? Yeah, like. you want to jump on to uh, the Chris action. Fat me off, baby. <laughs> <laughs> uh, jumping on to Chris Curtis there has got a pro record of 31 That's wins with 10 oh, losses yeah. with 17 KOs and one submission and five first round finishes Ooh. and his UFC record is five wins with two losses he made his UFC <laughs> debut in 2021 he also was on a Denmark contender series in 2018 and as we all know we've seen it in the replays he does currently have a win over his opponent yeah yeah he's done it before will he do it again um, I get into fighting style or Jordan uh, cools down for a little bit. That was... Uh, that yeah, was... you fucked me off really good and proper there. <laughs> <laughs> so, fighting style for the action man. Action man right here. Southpaw fighter. He um, Oh, did you also mention he was on against the fence, Ash? Missing the facts. No, that everyone knows that. That would have ticked JK right off. Yeah. So, uh, probably glad you said it. all over this mic. <laughs> so, all around <laughs> clean striker who keeps his lead hand low and will sneak that jab right up to the target as well. Like, you can't count Chris Curtis out. He's capable of landing that fight, changing shot at any given point. He stays patient. Yes. He's waiting on that perfect opportunity to fire his hands. He pays a lot of attention to the body. And that's what I love about this guy. Um, full of action. Before he goes up top, he touches that body first and he's great at disguising those shots as well. And even just drawing opponents into that counter defensively he uses that traditional boxing shoulder roll kind of shell up uh, um philly shell looking uh, sh um, uh stance and approach he used that that roll to protect his chin before creeping forwards and landing his combinations and counter strikes but like i said he's just a wizard at drawing those opponents in so he can counter strike yeah. even though they, they they're looking out for it he's just a, got a real good way of getting what he wants in the stand-up Mm, yeah, give me more facts. Anyway, jumping on to his opponent of uh, Brendan These Allen, then, who's got a well. record of 23 wins with five losses, Loads. with five KOs and 14 oh. submissions. And he does have 11 first round finishes. Uh, and his UFC record is 11 wins with two losses. Uh, and he's, uh, he made his UFC debut in 2019. He also was in a Denmark contender series in 2019. He's on a six fight win streak. He's got the second most submission wins in the middleweight division, and he is tied with Charles Oliveira for the for the third longest submission winning streak, which is four. It's a lot of history points. Yeah, I mean was... those history points probably predated Tutankhamun. Yeah, I've, I remember learning about those history points in um, history back in year five. Indeed. Before ah. I get into the fine style points in, we got to welcome on in Nolan oh, Zebra is back in the house. Oh, have to. Yes, yes, Nolan. Have to. What's yes. up, Jesus? It's NZ3. 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 Yes. Yes. My man. Yes. Morning to you, sir. So good to have you. You are doing well. Yes, good to have you good. Good, good to hear from back you. Back in the house, brother. Some love for Nolan man. in the chats, everyone, That's please. It. Good to see you, Nolan. In. Welcome in. Show him some love. love. There is Five no man like no land. Four. Oh. Brendan Allen. <laughs> we all look at that. Uh, he's an orthodox fighter, black belt in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, tight guard, keeps his hands high. He's take one uh, to land one, start a fighter. He'll make sure he's the last person to throw in the exchanges. Throws clapping kicks to the body <laughs> with a side of knees up the middle. Two. Very skilled in the grappling exchanges. He has. Uh, the ability to bait you into false sense of dominance and then explode into dangerous positions 
manipulating momentum to do so. Such an artist on the ground, lethal in close encounters with those devilish elbows he has in his arsenal too. Indeed, indeed. As the canvas goes to black and the chats rise up. Anything new? Yes. Um, Wales says, friend of the channel, Chris Curtis, don't tell me any of you picked Alan. No, I went Chris. Round yeah, two yeah, again, yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just um, going to change my pick now. Nolan says, uh, <laughs> looking forward to 300 next week. I'll be around for that. Yes, indeed. You've got to make sure you're there. Where it's going to be a... Mate, it's gonna be it's gonna blast off, mate. It's gonna be sick. It's gonna be so good. Hmm. Um, hey guys, thanks for the love. Um, any time for you, brother. All Wales time. says uh, this time. was a tough one for me. Very close fight. Alan has got better since their last fight. He really has, though, and that's where I get why people have picked him. And why he's the favourite? But um, you know, we so shall see. Does shorts come in either blue or red writing name? So I guess you can choose. Because this is Probably. white and blue, but last time it was white and red. Oh, yeah, right. But I just wish they matched the gloves. Well, he was going to get... Is it purple, though? Because there was rumours that he was going to get purple shorts. Really? I think the writing For might be purple. For reason? I don't know. That's colour, is it? Yeah. We need a close-up. Oh, it suited him, yeah. But also, I just no, wish... Blue. It just bothers me. They just match the gloves. Yeah. Or was he going to be in the blue corner prior to Chris stepping no, in? No, not at all, because he's miles up there in the rankings. Yeah. So he's number six. Surely he would have had like a streak. his name in blue or in red on the white shorts. Don't know why they do that. Just match the gloves because Chris has got black and red, and he's in the blue corner. Mm. Wow. Oh yep. no, mate, we missed you too, brother. No, we I missed, missed you. Too, you. We're glad that you are back and um, you you tuning in. Uh, with us and um, no, 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 I miss you 3,000. Part of it, that's right. 3,000. Do we do the uh, expectations? Have we done it. No, no. uh, far right. away. Let's go have Ash a look. Is not present. Oh, he is away, Ooh. isn't he? Okay, so real quick expectations in the blue corner for Chris, who's wearing the black shorts and red writing on. It's just bothering me. It's bothering me. Stop not the first time Chris is meeting Alan in short notice. In 2021, he won a round two. After stepping in short notice for Roman Delize, now he has a knack for being a bit of a nasty surprise for this guy. Alan used only a fraction of his toolkit in that first fight. Perhaps he got the ego um, and that got the better of him. But you can probably believe that the same won't be the happening in this time round. Uh, I'm not going to be underestimating Chris. He's seen what he's capable of. He's aware of the power. He's learned striking. Chris will probably likely work harder for his entries as well. And he probably will actually need to find ways to draw Allen into a brawl if he's going to have this on his terms. Creep forwards remain defensively acute, deflecting shots off of his shell and just finding entries to land his counters. That's going to be yeah, key Yeah, I think one, one key thing here as well for Chris is he needs to target the body like he did in that first fight mm. as well. Um, because that really slowed... Allen down quite significantly in that for, in that second round. Yeah. So he needs to do that again and get in close um, in order to land up top and make him fold. Uh, as for Allen, though, I think this time he needs to be, you know, he's had more time to prepare for someone like uh, Curtis. And I think he'll be ready for a five-round war. You could see Allen slow down in the second round and C Curtis was uh, the, the fresher fighter. Um, you would favour Allen on the ground in this fight, but we saw Curtis's takedown defence in that last fight. He's just literally got back. Oh, did he? Yeah. <laughs> did he was... well, what's happened? <laughs> he just switched scene. Was just like, switched scene because he's gone for too long. as you got back. <laughs> That's why I did it. Oh, I didn't want it. Oh. Like, Ash turned up. Yeah, don't want that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, as I was saying, yeah, you would favour Allen on the ground in this fight, but we saw Curtis's takedown defence in that last one. Um, and it was mostly contested on the feet. Allen's got to find a way to take the back and force Curtis to the ground uh, that way. Um, I guess similar to what Damon Jackson did uh, was in that second round of that Hernandez fight there. And I think Allen will be better at managing the distance this time and put his kicks on a bit more full display. Yeah. Who did you pick in the chat, guys? Yeah, who did you Alan. pick, boys? What do you think Chris Curtis? I went for you Chris picked Curtis. Alan. No, I went Chris Curtis round two. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah. Did you say so? Uh, what did you do, say? Oh yeah, Chris Curtis Allen. <clears throat> Uh, he, went, he, he, went, he went for Arnold. Yeah, went you know, for Arnold. Um, he went for Arnold, Arnold Allen actually. Arnold, Arnold uh, Curtis uh, Allen. I, I went for Curtis round three. Did you round three? I, I don't know right. what I did. Yeah. I think I went for sub or some sort. Oh, damn, I went decision. Uh, Wales saying salute to Nolan God bless. Wales has got Allen decision. Shango saying Ash doing an amazing impression of Rao versus Junior on a fight night. When was that? A. I don't know. Uh, Wales says honestly don't like Bro, him he's cocky he thinks he's S burn bro don't stink we don't like Callum Chris is humble hope he wins oh. mm. so last time we didn't see Alan use much of his long range weapons uh, so this time I reckon he'll be a little bit more wise to yeah, that yeah I think you've got Alan who's going to be targeting the body with his kicks yeah. and then you've got Curtis who's going to be targeting the body with his hands Mm. So, ooh, this is going to be interesting. Do not blink, guys. Yeah. Uh, welcome on in, Jose Be Becerra. Becerra. They fighting yes, they Jose. are Jose. Welcome on in. They are fighting hit that indeed. Like button and of course, hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel. So UFC fan channel. Oh fan dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. dear. Oh dear. Something's happened. Big body shot. Oh, 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 oh yeah, he's found an entry. He's going to get the back. Making Chris miss. He's got a back. But. You, I think you're about four seconds on us, Ash. Hey. I think you're about four yeah, seconds you, on us. Yeah. I don't think I can adjust it. I'll, do, I'll click on the thing. It's right. I'll click on the thing to slow it down. Oh, nice. <laughs> it's a wild way to go about it, but. Like the piece uh, this is not where Chris wanted to be, man. See what Shango meant earlier. He said that Ash was invisible away from the stream, like Rob versus Junior in his last fight. Uh, oh. Okay, yeah. Did he old uh, Cena, didn't you? John Cena. Right, so not the position that Chris wants to be in here, mm. but so far he's hand fighting, doing the right things. Um, two on one, two on one. Yeah. This is like proper hand fighting right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> look him in the eyes, Chris. 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 <laughs> God, look him in the <laughs> eyes. His facial expressions are hilarious, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> uh, trying to look at him. It's like <laughs> Smash that light button, guys. Look at me in the eyes. Look at me in the eyes. Oh, explosion. Come on about to... Yeah. Nice. Nice. Nicely nice. done, Chris. Nice. Perfect oh, timing. He's up. <laughs> Alan was just lying down and inviting him in like a Ooh, Ooh, elbow, elbow nice from shot. Alan. Wow. From Chris. Nice uppercut. Three and two. I'm not too worried if uh, Curtis loses the first oh, two fine, rounds, to be honest. Fine. Well, says Alan's plan to take him down and do this. He has PTSD from the last fight. Jose says, I. Betted on the fight time under 14.75. Pray for me, boys. Whoa. Damn, that's a specific. Oh. Um, yeah, it's like, it's basically under 3.5 rounds. All oh, right, I see. I was going to say, of course, but no, it's a five-round fight, yeah. Not three. Oh, nice. Come on, Chris. Stepping in elbows with Alan repeatedly. Uh, oh, good. Nice old. Oh, good body kick, man. Oh, oh yeah. Nice. Targeting that body again. Oh, he's landing nice the right jab. hand as well. Off the shot. Come on, Chris. We've got to crowd him here. And then the body. Good body shot. Chris, Oof. looking was he looking to switch stances there? Ooh. That's where I think he could have capitalized a little bit more, Chris, there. Could have threw a bit more when he had him up against the cage. Tuto's in the house. Yes, Tuto. Tuto, what's yes, up, bro? Tuto. Massive Welcome salutes in, and respects to ATF fam and crew. JK, Sai, Ash, Wales, Shango, Nolan. Greetings from... Welcome in, sir. Uh, <sighs> Princeton, Jersey. Second son. B-Day today. Ah, oh, happy birthday to your second son. His name's Princeton? Jersey? That's cool, man. That's a cool name. It's from Princeton, Jersey. <laughs> from Princeton. Oh, is that his name of his happy birthday from... Greetings Smash from a like Prince. on oh, the from video, Prince and Okay, my second son, B-Day. Today, 
All right, boys. One, two, three. Happy no. birthday uh, to you. you. I mean, you, you, this is how you lose viewers by singing, Ty. <laughs> this, is how, this is how I lose friends Sing as well, Sam. <laughs> 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 they've all left me they're all gone wow oh distance strikes okay sorry I thought it was total strikes distance strikes wow are we scoring these up I'm not sure what's the UFC site say has um, Alan gone five before or? Uh, not the full five I don't think no uh, not that I'm aware of that's why I nice went and Chris. third round so I thought because I thought Alan would tee off early, which is he has done. Mm. Uh, Rear naked see. chokes, Paul Craig in round three. Okay, Andre right, Muniz's right. fight was, I think, uh, it was three round. It got bumped up to the main, main event quite late, I believe, on that one. But yeah, no, I don't think he has. Um, I don't think Chris has either, but surely Chris can plow through. Um, yeah, we know. Shango saying Curtis That's needs it. to use those chances and close in. Yeah, sure. it. pick your nose, Alan. Pick your nose, mate. Live on camera. That's Let's it. see it. Get, get your finger right up there, mate. Go on. Oh, oh mate, digging for gold. Giving. Oh, he's, he's he's putting Vaseline up there. I think. I think. Yeah. I hope anyway. Maybe slow your stream down a little bit more, Ash. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, click I in. think oh, I right. think if you click about that three, four times. So I'll let you know when we're going in. We're not yet. <laughs> Alan touched the ref's hand, but he wasn't even needed to. Okay, in. time is in. That's where we at. That's where we at. Okay. Coming 52, down. 52, 51, 50, 49, 48, 47, 46. So on. And so on. Okay. Kicks Come are coming on, a little bit slower from Alan now, but still. Did he score that last round for? Maybe did, did Alan steal it? Oh, Alan took that round, yeah. Yeah, yeah I think so. He, had the, he took, the, took the round like he took the back. Yeah, exactly that, mate, yeah. Here we go, the side kicks. Ooh. I like how Alan turns that hand over, don't you? That right hand. Really throws it and puts a lot of twist. Chris, got Chris Kurtz fainting that jab out. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. land a good Ooh, shot there. Like exchange again. Land a good shot there. This is good for Chris. He's now got him back to against the cage. Mm. Oh, good combo go again. On, Chris. Bad Chris. Very blocked, good. Though. Back him up. Be the omen. That we always knew you were. Can't, Chris. Second round, baby. Shut up. Oh, <laughs> nice. I went for a high kick there. That guard goes high, Alan. You can find the body off of that. Yeah. Chris did so well then, raising his guard when Alan did that head kick earlier. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Oh. Great. Boy. I'm hoping this pressure from Curtis... Uh, Fades, Alan, if the fight goes long. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, agreed. I see where you went third round this time. Expecting a slower paced fight compared to the previous. He's always got a pot to his punches as well. Yeah, the, the Mark andre Barry fight was a bit of a weird one to me. It was kind of like it? a sparring match in front it of was, a crowd, yeah. really. They started to pick it up in that third round, though. Yeah. And Chris was just mostly just touching him. Got Chris Curtis skirting around the outside Oof. of the octagon here. Alan. Oh. Sorry, not oh. no, Alan skirting around is what I meant to say. Oh, oh hello. Angus is in the house. He says, been preying oh. on Chris Curtis's downfall for a long time. <laughs> Welcome on in, oh. Mr. Jenkins. No, you are no friend of no, ours then, Angus. Yeah. Oh, Alan's got him backed against the cage. No, oh, no, no, has. no, no. Alan's pouring him on, man. He is. You got a little promo for him and his missus earlier as well, which was a little special, these two, isn't it? These two are like proper playing games with each other as well. Like when one misses, they're pointing at, pointing at the other. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. I like those hands. I like those hands. I yeah, Alan's Curtis doing a good job up. at evading though. They're basically sparring each other. 
Mm. Yeah, just touching, touching, point finding at the moment. But Ooh, we really Chris like going for kicks now. Okay, so to, to load up. Himself a balance yeah, throw, Chris don't really throw kicks, does he? Mm. Oh, oh, nice knee from Alan. Oh, knee up the middle. That was, wasn't it? Right on the old solar plexus. Yeah. Big. Oh, knee. Alan trying to counter with a hook there. Um, what I love about Curtis is that he learned lessons from the Hermanson fight and he's no longer I mean to be fair Alan is not that in, in, ev evasive Oof. but he's not just chasing mm. people around the octagon that fight against Mark andre yeah. Barrio, he stood his ground and he says come here mm. and I thought that was really cool um, so he's either finding ways of getting ahead of that lead leg or he's just at least not chasing people into a frustration like he did against Hermanson the good thing the good thing that Curtis is doing here, what I said a second ago, with them two playing games with each other, is keeping the fight standing by playing games like this. Yeah. Yeah. Really good. But Alan's having some good success with the hands. He is having very good success, but Curtis has landed to the body, which I'm liking. Yeah. Did you check those striking numbers on this? I think. It's just about to come up. Hmm. Or in round one. Yeah. yeah, Chris is up. Chris is oh. up only just, but it's it's not going to tell you much. Because yeah. it looks like Alan's been more effective with them. Are you two chatting Welsh in here? Blimey. Or did someone just drop you know, their hand on the keyboard? When, uh, two Welshmen are chatting Welsh. You know, it's getting late. <laughs> someone just spilled coffee on the keyboard. Good enter the round from Curtis. Um, I don't know who Ooh. took that round, though. Oh, a little friendship hug there at the end of two. Uh, yeah, I mean, Chris is very grateful to be having this fight, of course. This does wonders for his career. He can jump leaps and bounds up the division. If you saw on the screen already, he is, what, around 40? Wee, 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 Henry Wolf. He's a bit down there. <laughs> Henry Wolf. Alan is being stupid not using his ground game, says Shango. It's being stupid. Nah, not... I, I, I don't think he needs to do it in this fight. Alan's, Alan's dangerous, man. I think I think he's doing the. I know he's getting tagged, and Alan's doing very well, to be fair. But this is five rounds, and we're going to see some replays here. The body shots from Curtis has been immaculate. Yeah, yeah I say it's one one. And this is why I went third round because just uh, I, I know Chris is tired as well, but he digs deep. He does. He's going to go for shutdown now, is he? Mm. Yeah. So I'm hoping he can get this this round. Can Ash get his round? I three. need at least one three. I do want this for Chris Curtis. I really do. Is this three now? The round, yeah. yeah. Well, you don't. I'm telling you, mate. Right. I'm <laughs> 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 at the end. I'm saying, sorry, sorry, picked against you. <laughs> sorry, picked against you. Actually, mate. I thought, I thought we were, I thought you two were friends. Yeah, the app bugged out. Mm -hmm. Who did you bet on, Ash? Where did you put your money, though? Oh, Chris. He did as well. Okay. Josie said, round three, knockout, boys. Come manifest it with me. <laughs> <laughs> Two new Allens as well. Josie wants this. Maybe. I want this for Chris. Yeah, I want, I want this for jo Jose as well in the chats. Um, <laughs> Allen's still the favorite here. Yeah. Allen's name is purple. That's what it is. It's not blue. It's purple. Is it? I don't know. I thought I saw it earlier in the light. It looked like it was blue. It did earlier, yeah. But in this light, it does look purple. Maybe that's what they got. This Brendan Allen's going to nick Mildew. Brendan Mildew Allen. No. Going to take Mildew. <laughs> no. You'll have to fight for it. I mean, I can think of worse things to fight for. Better things. <laughs> Oof, good oh. Oh, good, good right. Who's? Okay, that's oh, probably there, isn't it? Oh, nice. Alan's been really good at being third in the exchanges. Yeah, you kind of got to be against Curtis. Curtis is now resetting. Oh, nice. Hands like low. Throwing, waiting for Curtis to respond. He's pulling away and then he's getting straight back on the offense again. Where's the body shots like the first fights as Wales? Yeah. I want an uppercut from you, Chris Curtis, at this point. An uppercut. Is there a particular way of how this has to be finished, uh, Joe? Are we talking about submission? Are we talking about knockout? Joe? He said yeah, knockout. Jose. He said uh, he knockout. Said was it? Knockout. 
Oof. Uh, what we got here? Huh? Oh, here? not another eye poke. Oh. Oh, not again. See, Chris has had been on the receiving end of bad pokes. Uh, well, he did against Nasty and Mavov, didn't he? Yeah. See, see what Brandon Allen did there. I know Chris didn't jump all on the floor. Uh, I know Chris didn't do a Bruno jump on the floor, but respect Allen stopped. You know Where I mean? was it? I still can't see the eye poke. At what point? Yeah, but it was when he pushed him off. I still yeah, but Curtis is, is is holding his eye and he's still standing and peeling off, yeah. and indicating that he's been poked in the eye. He's mm. not fall to the ground as if he's been hurt. Yeah, by a punch. Not a punch. I don't know who that rest was good for. You know. Chris, mm. I'd say, because if you look at if you look at round one, Chris looked good in round one, I think. He looked better in round two, to be honest. Uh, no, he better in round two. Yeah, but I guess it's yeah true. A fresh Chris is always good. Joseph, the fight needs to end before the third round. Doesn't matter who wins or how. Oh, I see. Ooh. Come on, Alan. Gloves. Oh, head kick attempt from Chris. Ooh. That's and, not Alan. Uh, two two's bouncing because his mum's invited thirty people over. Uh, <laughs> Side <Norris>. buzzing. <laughs> Is that because of the eye poke? <laughs> yeah, I think it's a side buzzing. Oh, stop oh, with him! Oh, hello. Come on, Chris. This is just like Come the on, first Chris. one. Finish him. Come on, Chris. Finish him. Oh, oh damn! Whoa. Whoa. Big right hand from Alan. Big, big shoot as oh, well. Oh, don't wrestle. No. Jose does not like up, wrestling. Chris. He's taking the back. He's taking the back. Oh no! He's sunk in that body triangle as well. Our time is out on the other because side. of an eye poke, so I'm just going to whack that down. But we are 1 minute 52, 51, 50, Damn it, I nearly had my 49, third 48 uh, in the third I round. Think... Oh, wait, what? What did you just say? Stop giving him instructions. He's fighting with his corner. Damn. Oh he, oh, he says, stop giving me instructions. Because you're also telling Brendan Allen. What See, you can... Chris hasn't got much of a neck either, so I think it's going to be different to sub him. <laughs> yeah. But he's hand fighting really well. Wow, so close. Significant strikes. There's not a lot in it. Mm. But Chris did have the most significant shot of the round, perhaps. Chris, come on, Chris, got to shake him off. You reckon this is taxing on the legs of Alan? Yeah, I think so. There's a lot Chris of weight he's got to hold straight. up. I think you'd rather holding be him Curtis, so like, like holding him up rather than... Mm. Oh, yeah. Damn. Significant strikes. Alan, mostly, yeah. But it's... I mean, damn. Jose's shot. not liking That's this. It. It's just that moment when they initial grappling, grab playing, it was like, stop it. Yeah. So Chris said to his corner, stop telling him what I'm doing. I think Alan's leg, I was about to say, his leg's about to uh, come apart there. Mm. Mm. Wow, Whoa. I can't believe it was oh, my big elbow there from it, Brown. Man. I acknowledge that he caught him there. Oh, Jose. Shadow Sorry, v man. says uh, Curtis had him I'm hurt there. Alan finally using his ground game. Shango said, had JK as a point, you can't choke out a man's shoulders. <laughs> yeah, true that. Dude's got no, no neck. He's got a bear hug. But... That was the end of round three. What is the scores on the doors, though? Did you give it a round two? Because Chris wobbled him. Chris did wobble him, exactly. But vice versa, I feel like Alan wobbled him back. You know, I think Alan did well to to recover. Great. And take the back. But... Yeah, Chris rushed in too much for that finish there because uh, the... Uh, oh, like, the one two. How much it was off balance. Just missed yeah. the three, though. Stumbled. Uh, Psychopole says, right, as we've got to have to call it a night. 
Um, Awalas says, I spend more time with you three on weekends. <laughs> See you next yeah. Saturday for the 300. All right, Paul. Psycho Paul no knows problem. where he needs to be. <laughs> he, knows he knows it. it. That's it. Well, good round from Kurtz already. Yeah, was, here we go. Round four. Oh, nice straight left there from Chris. Oh, oh, back onto the body kick offense for Alan. Throwing a few feints at Chris as well. Right in round four. A lot of love, Psycho Paul. Thanks for stopping yeah, by. Love, brother. You're the man. And uh, we'll next see you next week for sure. Watch. Don't miss any of that. It's going to be absolutely And of course, join us for the breakdown of the week as well. Hydration. Oh, Ooh. yeah. Much more coming up. Do not miss that. Wednesday is when that is, by the way. Wednesday. Oh. Oh, oh he, hurt shot. Did he, he hurt him with a body shot. He did. Oh. I, I wasn't sure because Chris oh, was like, on, Chris threw it as he was peeling backwards. So I wasn't sure if there was much power in that. Didn't seem like it, but I didn't ask for it. Yes. Come on, Chris. Wash. Ooh, oh, now we've got another eye poke, but for Arnold Allen. Arnold I don't Allen, know if that was, you know. For Brendan Allen this time. I don't know. Damn. I don't know. Let's have a look at this. What back? Because Chris never has his hands open. It was a punch. The oh, punch. it might have been, it might have been the poor... Might have been a scrape. Might have been scraped towards the end. Oh, they've got a fight. They've got to continue. You have to carry on. Punch, yeah. Apparently. Oh, okay. Oh, I don't know. I, th I think it was a scrape because, off the because end of that punch. Chris never has his hands open. I thought open. that as well. I thought that as well. I thought it was a bit of a, scra a scrape. Yeah. Chris never has his hands open. It's sad. It's mm. mad. His hands literally live closed. Even when he's walking down the road, just his hands closed. When he's paying. Hands ready to throw whenever. When he's using his phone, his hands are closed. Guys at that Sean Strickland School of Hard Knocks. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> does the does know how to open a palm. <laughs> Just full full fist everywhere. When he makes love to his bird, his hands are closed. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Ooh. Oh. Faster with the shots now is Chris. He is. He's kind of making this fight hit for sure. Yeah. Love his resets Brennan as well. Allen might just kind of slow down in this fourth round. But it depends on how the judges scored the first three. Oh, he shot under. Oh. Oh, well timed from down. Allen. Yeah. He's got the legs locked got together. Oh, Chris Curtis is going to give oh, up his back, back right in the middle here. With two minutes to Damn spare. Swear a lot of Alan hand fighting early. B center of the canvas with this. Oh. Deary me. Oh, nice explosion. Oh, oh. Nicely done, Chris. Really good. good job. Oh, Beautifully brilliant. done. No points for you, Alan. Get up. <laughs> not recruiting. <laughs> no points, not recruiting. Back on it, Chris. Oosh. I'm going to get, get that timer head. down. We had a misinterpreted eye poke. So we lost time there. Get on that nice body shot. Oh, good straight left. Ooh. Oh, this is a body. Wow. I would always admire how Chris finds the body. He's just a master mm. of it. Oh, oh Alan a good shot elbow. there. Why, he just keeps pointing Ooh. every time he lands something good, yeah. doesn't he? I figure, it's getting I, really I annoying now. Yeah, I figure. I'm like, just, just end him, Chris. I think you wanted to just kind of point out that wasn't an eye poke. I feel like that was. Yeah, we've not seen much kicks um, for mm. Alan, from Alan. As, of his, oh. Oh, as he oh. says that, as he says that, there's a high one. Flies one nicely through the guard. Partially eaten by Curtis. But Curtis has got a dog mentality. Like he hits, a, he gets, he receives something that hurts him. And his oh, default is to respond still. Quick map return there from Chris. Nice. Good ground defense all fight from Chris. This Shango, I've got to agree. And even though it's his advantage standing up, got to respect it a bit. Mm. Yeah, true. Yeah, I wonder yeah, how the judges will look at how... Oh. a very good sense of urgency as well, Curtis, when he stands up. Well, Chris, up. fight the fight legs. Oof. 
Peel away these hands. Oh, it's up. great at turning. Oh, he's done it again. Oh. 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 Alan, Alan read that oh. one Man step ahead. Seconds. Yeah, that was so unlucky, man. But yeah, can he do anything with it? That's the big question. Mm. There's no submission here. He just really has to put a hurt on. Yeah. I'll rain down the strikes if I was him. I wouldn't want to be a judge. I don't know who's winning this fight, man. No. 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 <laughs> Done nothing with that. And end of round number four. Back to the corner, Chris. We're going to regroup. Chris is looking good. That's it, mate. Chris regroup. is looking good. Oh, last round coming up, guys. Steady. Oh. Steady with it. No one says, see you guys next week. ATF hoodie, tea in hand. Yeah, man, Let's bro. go. You know where to be, brother. Yes, it is. See you again, Nolan. It's going to be Pop so dope, by. man. It's going to be so dope. Ooh. Who's saying they need to finish? We'd also like to know from you guys, so do write in to let us know how you're celebrating UFC 300. Yes. If there's any particular ways in which you guys are doing something special for UFC 300, perhaps watching it with your grandma, your aunt, your mum, or, uh, you know, like Nolan Zebra, a cup of tea and biscuits with the ATF hoodie. You know, would you be celebrating by donating to the channel? Ooh, who knows? But let us know what you're doing to celebrate. We'd love to hear it. Oh, sorry. Time already. Last five Come minutes. On. Get it going. Here we go. Last Ten. one. We're in. Come on, Chris. Everything. The kitchen sink Oof. and your nan's knickers. Chuck it all in. <laughs> the lot. Oh, oh nice good hand, nice Chris. <laughs> Go on. Stay counter striking here. Yep. This round does mean everything. It yeah, be... I don't know how to score it. I really don't. Yeah, I don't know. I really be don't two know. Two. Do I don't you know, know? I love I love a fight when I can't score it. Yeah. Joey, you know I mean? it's so many fights I can score it and I can tell you, but when I can't score it, I'm like, I'm actually I feel like the the judges are actually earning their paycheck now. Ow! Oh knee at the middle from Chris! <laughs> Alan sponges it. This would be so good for Chris. The story. Like, oh, nice. no, he's going to give up the back again. How many times is Chris going to hurt him? And then Alan's going to grab, get the back mount mm. so early into the fifth round as well. Oh, man. Come on, Chris. We've got to shake him off. We've got to shake Come him on, off. Mate. Oh, he's going for, on. A, Whoa. for a heel hook. Go for a leg lock. Oh, damn. Just like the first fight. Just like the first fight. That's it. Make him get up. Make him get up. <laughs> Back on it, Chris. Back on it. <laughs> the way he Go runs on, dog. Off. Love it. Man. Chris don't want none of that ground smoke. Oh, that oh, knee. knee to the body. Yeah, that body. That landed to the body. Oh, oh man. Alan. Good straight shot there for Chris. Oh, good sprawl. Nice. Nice sprawl, nice sprawl man. Very good. Oh, but Alan's not doing anything. That's it. Push down on yeah, that I was head. About, I was about to go mad about oh, saying Chris needs to get out of that scenario, man. Man's like a zombie. He needs to get out of that scenario, but he done well. Yeah, he did so well. Oh, oh again. He just again. turns that punch on, over so nicely. Show him what you're made of, Chris. Come on, Chris. Come on. The action man. Bring oh, all the lead, action. Lead up a cut there. Alan just bringing Chris a boxing on, Chris. strategy to the boxer. Oh, went high. Oh, high oh. with that. Oh, good jab. Nice from Alan. Oh, turn it over the hook that time. Man. Man. Chris is taking some big shots. Big um great sprawl. Big deep breaths. Yeah, got to do damage, Chris. Yeah, but look, back, of the, right. back of the head, you can't do that. Brandon got his arm. Come on, Chris. He's just trying to, yeah. Brendan Allen's in desperation to try and get this fight to the ground. Get up, yeah. That was dead. Uh, he's he's yeah. finished, mate. 
Chris, he's finished. He want, he don't want no more. He can't strike anymore on the feet. Wow. Oh, he's throwing though. Oh, oh. desperation oh, wow. again. Shot for that single. Oh. He's deeper though. Alan's deeper this time. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Shot, um, he's got a back. Back again for Alan. Wow. Hello, my friend. I've got your but back judges, again. He's, the, he's, he's been defending this. He has been doing so we got well, Chris. A minute to go. A bit more sweatier as well. Yeah. So, but even harder. Yeah, yeah. Two on one. Chris has got the perfect remedy to get out of these scenarios. One minute left, and I feel for Alan. Alan knows it's all down to this. Yeah. He's got to wind that clock down. He's got to get he that hand over. He can't get a left hand out. Explode, Chris. Explode. Here we go, fighting the hands. Come on. Keep fighting those hands. No, he hasn't. Brennan can't get his. Turn, turn, Chris. Turn, Chris. Turn, Chris. Oh, oh man. Oh, go on, Chris. Like, no. That's Whoa. it. 30 seconds and finish solid. Oh, that's it. Get him up. He's yeah, so make sure he's get up. There we go. Back on the offense. Oh, knee. Yo. Ooh. Big knee from Curtis. Such a sick fight. This is this has got to make his own. Bring it home, fight Chris. Right for me. Bring it home. Oh, Chris is hurt. Is he? Is he? Chris is hurt. He is. What's happened? Chris What's survived, happened? Chris! Five oh, no, seconds he got left! It. He's nearly got it. Oh, he needs, no. he needs to empty it all. Oh, what's happened? Look, he got his leg. Oh, my days. Yeah, at the end. Oh, don't, is, did he pull his hamstring? I think he pulled his hamstring. Right at the end. Right at the end. What a war indeed. Uh, I, I think as well, like, th that last 10 seconds there was not good on Chris Curtis's behalf. If that didn't happen, that was a good round for Chris as well. <sighs> Defending the takedowns, getting the How position. did that happen? But look, the ju judges need to know that that... Yes, that was Curtis was in a compromising <laughs> position, but that was nothing that Alan did. It would have been, right? He's whilst he was getting up, right? He done his hamstring. Yeah, in. I think it was, yeah. yeah. While he was getting up, but from... It wasn't like uh, any any damage that Alan, <coughs> Alan caused. Imagine that. Just get all these strikes and punches Surely and you're not standing give up Alan is what that damaged last round you. Just for that. <laughs> standing up is what damaged you after get an actual full five rounds yeah, of hell I mean? poured on you. Like, Didn't you, do yeah, anything. Like eating head kicks and then you pull your hand <laughs> by yeah, standing up. <laughs> Come on now, Chris. <laughs> Nolan's back. He says I'm like, on the floor I'm crying. Oh, Ooh. some scrap. I'm I'm struggling with fighting tonight tonight. I've been pleasantly, that has got to be pleasantly, fun, uh, pleasantly fed. Oh with, man, that had me, had me on my fist oh. full content. Oof. Look, he's he's limping. Bless him. Yeah, looks muscle. Hopefully, yeah. So what was it? This. So was it whilst no. defending the takedown? Alan steps over. Seems good. Oh yeah. Was it his knee? I didn't see. It's no. as he as he as he stepped back up. There's something popped, so uh, his knee went. Oh god, I can't deal with this. Man. Come on, Chris. Forty-eight forty seven guys. Oh my days. No. no, absolute no way. Yo. That is BS, man. These judges, what on earth? No, I need to see a full card, mate. I need to see a full card and a breakdown. I mean, it's, it's not a robbery. It, it was a close fight, but I, surely there was three rounds for Chris Curtis there. I Four think, and five yeah, were definite. Yeah. I, I do think, I genuinely feel like those last 10 seconds no, cost yeah, him. Yeah, no, I think those 10 not seconds. Not a chance. Not a chance. Yeah. Chris dominated that whole round. You reckon he, you reckon he still would have run that round? Yeah. He was winning Bro was it. defensive. Yeah, I know, but when you kind of see that fight ending, it's like, oh, is the person who actually nearly got the other person out? It was Alan. No. It wasn't, it wasn't to do with Alan, though. Alan's damage. 
but he could steal the round just by the fact that it was so very nearly fight ending. There's not really points for Alan. Oh, so Alan uh, now wants to run it back with Sean Strickland. Yeah. Uh, Justin Villager, uh, Villagas, welcome in, brother. Uh, Alan, in. yes, yes it was good, bro. Overgo and sell the fight. What the f? Sitting next to him. Uh, he says now it's does. like a beauty contest. Don't go sit next to the competition. Get up, shake your tits still, and make sure you get those extra votes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. You got you got a real good we point got, there, we got the rankings Justin. One, we, lads? We yeah, well, yeah. You got a really good point there, Justin, because that's that's what you're told to do. Like you see him on the corners, like, like go shake your ass, go shake. You know, put your hands up, win the crowd over, look like you're the fresher fight. You still got it. Don't don't sit down in the feet next to your opponent. Although showing good respect for Chris Curtis is what happened there. Chris went out on his shield, man. He absolutely did. Yeah, I, th I, I, I definitely think it all. Do, I would love to see what judges gave. If they gave Chris round number five, then fair enough. But if they didn't, then it was all down to that last ten seconds. I think. Mm. No. Um. But yeah, let's get to the rankings for Brandon Allen and Chris. Check that out. Yeah. Um. So. Uh, Fights to be made here. To add to this, yeah. I think uh, must mention they the fact that... They just said they gave it to Brandon Allen, fifth round. They gave... Nah, that's BS, man. That's total BS. That's what it went down to, Last fifth 10 round. seconds, nah. Still the deal. I don't think two, Allen two did enough fifth. to actually go out and, and try and that finish final, the fight. Honestly, that final yeah. 10 seconds... Like if he if Man. he would have poured it on when Chris was against the cage there and Chris fell down, yeah. then okay, I'd be like, right, he had Chris in a compromising position and enough to steal the yeah. round, but he didn't. No. Uh, but anyway, yeah, we've got we've got Alan in at six still. I don't think he's going to move. No. Um, does he fight Jared Cannonier or does he actually fight Sean Strickland? You'd think that. Maybe he could be Sean Strickland. Well, one thing I must add, apparently, rumour has it that Sean Strickland was meant to fight Robert Whittaker. Oh, wow, really? Apparently. Apparently that was lined up. But I, I don't know okay. when that was because that could have been at a time when they were looking to put Hamza on the Saudi Arabia card that's, that got cancelled. Yeah. Um and I think that they would have done uh, Cannoneer and um, Hamza. Obviously. Yeah, that's the, that's the thing. What are they going to do with Drickless? Do they do Duplassie versus Izzy? Or do they rematch Sean and Duplassie? Well, that is a bit of a do? debate, really, at the moment, I think. That's up in the air. It's probably swinging likely that they'll do Izzy versus Drickless in Australia. Yeah. I think that because they, they've announced that they're going back to Australia... Uh, of course, maybe it could be Tapura versus Volk. Tapura is apparently going to be meeting the UFC in Miami um, over... Uh, mm. I don't know if he's already had the meeting, but I did see something or read something. So that could also headline the Australia card. But at the same time, if you're the champion, why would you defend your belt in the challenger's hometown? Surely you want to call the shots. Yeah. Right? Yeah, no, that, that's so true. That's true. Izzy versus... But, this is, yeah, and on the other hand, you've got then why would you do Izzy versus Drickus in Australia? I mean, it's coming off a loss, and it is. It's coming it's off a loss. Oh, I know it may sell. Yeah, I know it may sell. But then, do you wait until the um that uh, Saudi Arabia card and see if Shemaev wins? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I I I think so. But I mean, personally, what I think that makes sense from uh, a rankings perspective and fights perspective, you would run back Strickland versus Duplessis. For money rise for the yeah, UFC, yes. you would yeah. do Izzy versus Drickus. Um, yeah, that's true. And then you could probably do Izzy versus Brendan Allen, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Brendan well, Allen's just defended his ranking. He hasn't done anything. He just did. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Did I say he hasn't? He's just, he's just defended his ranking. So I, I don't think he's done anything that's like, do you know what I mean? You kind of have to have a fight that's already up there in the top five to then warrant 
a a shot at someone who's like it. Well, saying that is, you know what I mean? Is is like he's submissioned Munoz, submission Paul Craig, and a lot of people. Joe Cannon is said, there. Yeah, but I, I yeah, I know. Yeah, I I don't know when Jared Cannon is due to come back though. He's been be out for a to while. To be fair, Cannon versus Brandon Allen that could make sense. To be fair, yeah, but is it? Um, but does it make sense timing wise? Um, it makes, probably it makes not. sense it's in terms of like matchup wise, what should be next. Absolutely. Yeah. Mm. Uh, to be honest, he could fight either Fatori or Canavier. Yeah. 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 But it, like, like you said, you just need to know the picture of who, who's who, who's fighting for the belt. Is it going to be Strickland rematch or is it going to be Izzy? Yeah. Because then, then you've got the ploy of the rematch of Strickland versus Adam. Um, yeah, I agree, that, agree with that. Yeah. yeah. Because then that's pretty much the, your only option then if you're Sean Strickland. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But if you're Chris, I actually like the look of Roman Delize or Anthony Anthony Hernandez. Uh, they train together, don't they? Yeah, whoever, they have whoever loses. Together. It's just Delize and Chris. I don't know if Delize is still training over there though. At Extreme Couture, that would have to be mm. something that need looking into. Because if they're not, then the loser you know, of that fight would be good. Have... I think. Uh, Delize yeah, or I Hernandez. Agree. I mean, got to give Chris some props because I, I felt like he. He exactly, yeah, he which is why yeah, I've suggested fights that are above him, yeah. not below. Um, but yeah, I, I feel you're right. I think mm. the UFC should at least yeah, honor his performance. Fight someone. Um, yeah. You got Anthony Hernandez versus Delizia saving a card. First, though I think the winner of that could, yeah, could be it because yeah, maybe if Anthony Hernandez uh, wins that, he could fight Chris. Maybe I think Anthony Hernandez has got a good chance against Delizia. You mean if Hernandez beats Delizia and then goes up to ten, he should. Defend against Chris. Yeah. Mm, I don't know how, do what, about Chris warrants him going that high, but yeah, I, I wouldn't be mad at well, that. Well, it, 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 to be fair, it, this fight was never scheduled, so it's not like Chris was he, scheduled he saved the card. To, to, to fight all the way to six. He, Like you said, yeah, he stepped in on short notice. And the reason because that was because he already had a win over him, so that warrants a leap, if you get what I mean. Mm. But uh, yeah, I do agree. Chris coming off a loss, jumping that high to nine. Obviously, if Hernandez was to win. Do you know what though? This could very well be a trilogy I never even knew I wanted. <laughs> because yeah. because yeah, you know, yeah. Alan, yeah. Alan and Not Chris long. fighting again. Especially how this one turned out is kind of like I need to know. I need to know. But Does, we're um, a long way from it, I think. Yeah. Or, or does Chris fight the guy that Sean Strickland beat? Does he fight Abyss? Chris fight Abyss maybe. <sighs> A bus, I think, is booked, isn't he? I'm He's full. Sure. Uh, oh, I think I saw him booked. I can't. Oh no, that was uh, he, he, his his last fight was against uh, Bradio, wasn't he? Bradio beat him. Yeah, that's, that's if why. you saw his name. That's that was why his name was there. Uh, I'm just trying to have a look, see if I can see him. Just trying to think of what other middleweights that are not but uh, that are not ranked. Not gonna fight Chris because Chris has got to defend his ranking now, surely. I know I'm saying that, and then he, you know what I mean. Mm. I mean, oof. you've got several people here. Mm. Oh, I, I tell you what would have been a, a, a like an easy winnable fight for him would have been Paul Craig. Yeah. And that would have just get that would have stepped him up a bit because yeah, Paul Craig's gonna lose to well actually I don't know actually because Braulio style. He's perfect for Craig because Bradley just goes for takedowns, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah. And I think Paul Craig could put off a submission. Maybe if Paul Craig wins that, because he's not going to go up, he's not going to move. Yeah. So then that, that could potentially happen. Paul Craig versus Chris. Looking at uh, looking at guys outside of the rankings, um, you've got Gregory Rodriguez, two fight win streak, coming off of a TKO win against. Uh, yeah. But we don't want that for Chris. Chris. Um, You've also got Ikram Aliskerov. The UFC are going to be pushing. Him I think he's already put it. Like he's got one in the pipeline, isn't he? he? Maybe nothing's announced though. Nothing's confirmed. Ah. Yeah. Um, look, if 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 Ikram, someone like that guy comes in, I would like to say put him against Jack Manson, but please. Yeah, look, he could probably come in against the loser of. That he'd say, you know what I mean? He's, he's, he's got some reputation coming through. He doesn't have to start at the top, uh, lowest 15 ranked there. But also, mm. I think if Chris Curtis is going to fight, we've got to think about that injury he's got. And I think yes. it's going to take a minute. It's, it's going to be at least six weeks for hamstringing it. <laughs> six weeks? Months? No, I, months. I don't think... Uh, 
Yeah. Wait, what, six months? Six months. You said six weeks. Six yeah. weeks is like, you it, know. Me, he popped his knee though, so I, I could know. I could just about repair my broken nail in six weeks. Yeah. <laughs> that's not no, but that, that, that's standard recovery for a hamstring injury. Six weeks? Yeah. Weeks? You might be right. For a hamstring, yeah. yeah. I guess uh, no, uh, a, a knockout is months, though, right? Like, a knockout is months, but weeks is... It looked like he got carried out yeah, in a stretcher. Like, I don't know, think that'd be some, weeks. Some, some, some footballers uh, come back within six weeks after a hamstring injury. Right. Depends how bad the hamstring injury is. Depends if it's a strain or a tear. Mm, yeah, yeah, that's true. Mm, he did get carried go. out in a stretcher. Uh, hamstring strain, six weeks. If it's a tear, yeah, you're looking longer. Just to add then, uh, when we were talking about Abus, Abus is booked to fight Wally Alvarez. So that's Ooh, interesting. Okay. But that's just a, a random fight outside of the rankings. But um, yeah. Yeah, I think we've got a fair share of options for. Yeah, for true, this. true. Uh, should the UFC decide to give him somebody outside of the rankings? Um... Yeah, I think uh, Paul. If Paul, if Paul Craig somehow beats Borrelia, Paul Craig versus Chris could make sense. You yeah, know? timing wise, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, mm. timing wise as well. Yeah. Well, I don't know because it's next pay per view after the next. Uh, Let's yeah, go back to the screen bit... then. But I think that's a pretty good oh, I don't know. For Chris Curtis, um, I wouldn't mind him fighting up again with the loser of Delize slash. Um, yeah, he's not going to fight Delize though. Is they're, they're trained together. Mm. Uh, the loser of, but I mean, it's if they still are. We don't know if that's the case. But um, True that. we'll see how that pans out. Justin um, says, uh, you're not getting a title shot after this. Elameo, Drickus would beat him. Uh, he also says, wasn't texting as much into the fights, but uh, great stream, guys. Much love, brother. Much love. Good Good brother. I actually think Brandon Thanks Allen so beats. Um, being it, bro. Uh, did he say Delidze or yeah. um, uh, Duplassi? Tricus. Yeah. I reckon, I reckon Allen beats him, you know, mm. stylistically. I don't know. We'll see. No, I don't think about it. I mean, after that performance, it, it was a bit try hard, wasn't it? Um, Justin, do come back next week for UFC 300. Yes. Do not go away. Uh, without coming back and saying hey again. Yeah, absolutely. And of course, uh, try and make the uh, breakdown show in the week as well. So uh, pop the notifications yes. bell on the channel so Indeed. you can be notified when we're live. Uh, but usual, typical times uh, for us. Uh, Chang says, fight-wise, it's UFCs. So if Izzy is up for coming back, they will make that and lap up the pay-per-view sales. If that isn't the case, there is only Strickland. Angus says the middleweight division yeah. is really bad, isn't it? I don't think it is. I think it's quite um, quite hot enough fair, since I, I, we've had two champions yeah, in the last two years. I, I kind of agree and disagree with what you're saying because you've still got the likes of Vittori that's up there that's not doing much at the moment. Um, Cannoneer's not had a fight since the Vittori fight. Costa. I would like to see Costa and Chris Rankins. Curtis happen. I really would like um, to see that happen. Obviously, no, it's not a time, but I would like to see that. I'd like to see that as well. Obviously, Delidze after Blooming losing that, uh, unfortunately, to... Um, who did he lose to last up before Imavov? Delidze. Yeah. Oh, it was Hermanson, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, no, he beat Hermanson. No, yeah, he beat he? Hermanson. It was uh, Vittori. Oh, Vittori then. Yeah, that was... That was yeah, it. Yeah, that was it. After that robbery, sorry. Yeah. Because like, he was on the tear. Mm. So it would have been interesting to see what he would have done, but yeah, now that Shamayev's in the rankings, it could spice it up. Obviously, stylistically against Robert Whitaker, five rounds. I I don't see him getting past Whitaker to be honest. Mm. Okay. Big claim for me, big claim. I think I I think Whitaker finishes him. Right. El Capitano yeah. Rafael says, uh, "Great stream, brothers. Can't wait for UFC 300." Yes, absolutely. It's yes. next week. Let's wrap Stand this up. by. Yeah, bro. Uh, Shango was saying, agree, Rafa. Uh, see you 300, mate. Cheers, guys. What else is uh, Shango? He's a pro. Oh, okay. um, you were talking about rugby there. Um, uh, do, 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 do. Yes, Rafa. 300 is, is around the corner. It's going to be a great banger for sure. For sure, for sure. Lots coming your way on the event against the fence channel. So make sure, like we said, yes. hit that notifications bell. And hit a like on the video if you've not done so already, guys. Yeah. Lots coming your way, including even just more videos. More and more videos. Yes. Jack Content it galore. For UFC 300, so make sure you're sticking around. All right. Isn't that right, Hasby? He said yes. <laughs> he said yes. All right. See you later, guys. Ciao for now. Good night. Much love. See you later. Love, peace. and chicken. Bye-bye. <laughs> love, peace, and chicken. Greasing <laughs> yes, and chicken. All right, guys. Bye-bye. That was a two-foot challenge.